Alright, okay, hello, hi, how are you feeling? My absolute real ones, okay, I'm actually, I'm actually feeling really good right now. I'm, I'm feeling really good, okay, you, you guys wanna know why? You guys wanna know why? There is a, there's an amazing, there's a beautiful reason for this, okay, okay, check this out, check this out. Okay, so I did a little bit of grinding off stream, as in I played one stage twice, and would you look at this, look at this, okay, okay? I can fucking afford it, I can afford the crown, I can finally turn Frogger into a prince. King! Fuck yeah, okay, wait, I need, I need to actually, like, equip this now. Alright, alright, here we are, here we are, okay, 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 get ready for this? Get fucking ready for this, man. Get ready for this, okay. Oh my god! That looks so beautiful. Oh, Frogger, Frogger, you look so beautiful right now. Holy shit, kiss me, Frogger. Oh my god. Frogger is an absolute king, thank you. Gotta drink. Uh, quick, quick, immediate fuck you <laughs> to Pangoon. Okay, alright, let's see. Settling into a new apartment, there should be fun background noise. Like, oh, hell yeah! Okay. <laughs> okay, okay, get ready for me to scream occasionally then. Bro's actually the king? Absolutely, dude. Thank you, skater. Thank you so much. Absolute battle. Okay, so, um, in terms of what's happening in this game, it is, it is nothing interesting. <laughs> We are we are in Doom's Temple. I'm hoping this is the final area. If it's not, then I'm scared. The uh, second to last stage, the next will be a boss, I think. I don't know how this works. And uh, I'm pretty sure this is just one long puzzle. I'm used to random screams by now. <laughs> okay, good. Good. Hi, my G. Hello. Alright, okay. Frogger is always interesting, yeah. Yeah, no, I just I just need a frog harder. I think I'm the problem, honestly. Okay, wait. Oh, what the fuck was I on? Wait, <laughs> wait, no, no, no! Oh my god, dude, what the fuck was that? What the? Oh my god, dude, I fucking hate these patterns. I actually fucking hate these patterns. What the fuck, dude? Okay, I want one APN. Do I still have the one APNG in my sources? Wait, I I have to, right? I have to. Okay, image 23. Maybe? What is image 23? No, that's... Okay, oh fuck, that's that's art by uh, my main man, some guy with a coconut. Uh, drawing they did in my OC Dowser. Uh, I, I need to immediately credit them. Fuck, okay. Uh, image 22. There we go. Okay, this is Wani. Um, and Frogger. And uh, and the, the, the femboy Demi Croc made. Um, someone actually thought that they were a, uh, a fan character of mine? No, the Demi Crocs are official. They appear in one of the earlier stages. Alright, we got the Dragon Imposter. Absolutely beautiful. I'm assuming we're going to encounter Wani, uh, later in the stream, because he's, like, the big bad of this game. And, like, it wouldn't make sense if he didn't show up. Yeah, but, um, I think I, I think I've realized... That, like there's a there's a running theme in like bits I've done where I obsess over green crocodiles from like various media. I <laughs> it's a pattern at this point. It's genuinely a pattern. Okay, but... Oh wait, wait, wait. Do they please tell me they don't? Okay, there we go. Thank fuck. Okay. All right, let's fucking go. Okay, wait a minute. So I, oh yeah, right, I need to, okay, there we go. Beautiful! Absolutely beautiful, okay. I actually did it, guys, I actually did the puzzle. Are you proud of me? Vector is so cool, though, yeah. It's like, okay, okay. First it was Dino Rank, right? First it was Dino Rank. Um, then it was, um, then it was Vector the Crocodile, like, two years later, which I'm not going to explain for those uninformed. And then I think like now now it's Dr. Wani. I don't know I don't know why this has happened three different times. And I don't know if I'm like if I'm here for it or not. <laughs> okay, okay, so I need to push this. Okay. Progress. I like oh fuck wait now. Oh wait, no, never mind, I'm onto something. There we are, okay. Okay, wait, fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, genuinely, genuinely right now. Wait, no, what was I thinking? What the fuck was I- What? No, no, that's disgusting. What's wrong with me? Okay. Here! Here we go! 
progress. Thank you. Thank you. Wait a minute, actually. Oh wait, no wait. I think I, I think I understand now. Okay, so I need to find a way to get like actually get over there. Okay, okay. I I've done. I did this puzzle last week. Um, but I I just like it's it's just been been so long that like I I can't actually remember what I did. Or like what strategy is it right, actually? Maybe. Maybe maybe the answer maybe the answer is just that I need to like. No, it's not. Okay. God, motherfucking. I, I, I hate I hate having to do puzzles for the first time in any of these because it's, it's always just like. <laughs> it's always like. It's always like Sniper Wolf levels of like, okay, well, how the fuck do I like actually make commentary out of this? When it when it's like against enemies, then I can actually handle it, you know? Okay, or maybe. Per chance. I remember how stuck you were, yeah. No, it's not an easy puzzle, bro. This isn't this isn't an easy thing, man. Come on. What do you what do you mean I'm you always you always fucking say that, but I'm I'm never I am never coping, bro. I'm genuinely never coping. Because I actually I actually got through this puzzle if you haven't noticed. Uh last stream. I got through it. I did it, I was good. I knew how to get good. Wait a minute. Okay. Not okay. What the fuck's wrong with me? We're actually wait. This actually reminds me of like those fucking um Oh god, what were they? Okay, okay, so you know you know those like slide puzzles? Where like you would have to <laughs> Easiest puzzle fuck you you do it man <laughs> No Okay um wait 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 I, I I I guys guys I'm smart I swear to god I swear to god I can do this Fuck Oh my god, okay. Well, do I seriously have to <laughs> It'll be so embarrassing if I like have to look at the past stream to like understand what I even did there. No, I'm doing that, I'm doing that. Give me a give me a quick moment. Give me a quick moment. Okay, wait. Wait a minute, wait a minute. But I, I gotta like actually like hook up my my last stream just just so I can like just so I can be like extra schizo, you know? I, I, I wanna I wanna be able to like pull out my last stream I did and then just like be able to talk my talk to myself. Does that make sense? I hope that makes sense, because otherwise I'm scared for myself. Okay, okay, I'm gonna turn on my um my Safari window. Actually no, this isn't Safari. What the fuck am I on? Um okay, wait. Here we are. Okay, this is the last stream. What the fuck? Okay, okay, wait, can I turn the audio on here? Okay, desktop audio. Good, please. Okay. I don't think she would lose her mind playing it. She would lose her mind. Fuck you. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry. Wait. Wait. Okay. 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 Let me. Let me. Let me comb through this shit, man. Okay. Okay. What? What did I? What did I do? At what point did I actually start? Like. Okay. All right. It was. It. It was. It was. It was when. Okay. Let me fucking find this. I. I oh my god. And then there's that one part where we talked about timber. Uh, we are not interested in the fucking OCs here. Get that shit out of here, man. What the fuck? Okay, it was it was it was when Hawking like randomly like activated my brain. Okay. Wait a minute. Okay, okay, okay. What position was I in there? Okay, okay. So. Oh. Oh yeah. Well, that's. I yeah yeah that's what we're. An epiphany. Okay. Okay, please, please, dude, please. Okay, okay, okay. That is that is beautiful. By the way, by the way, I'm actually like following the exact steps <laughs> that I did in this stream. Okay, okay, pass me, pass me, pass me. Do it, do it, please. Oh my God. Okay, there we go. There we go. I'm genuinely so smart. I was genuinely so smart. Holy shit. That's beautiful. That that was so good. That was actually so good. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> Media fuck you to blow up. What the fuck, man? Okay. What do you mean stop coping? Okay, look at that. The puzzle is done. I did the puzzle. There. All I needed to do was <laughs> look reflect upon my past self. 
That's all I need, bro. Get better? I got better. Genuinely, bro. Oh god, and this is the part that fucked me over. Wait, actually, why did this fuck me over? This is this is so easy. What? No, I'm looking at this right now. This is this is such an easy puzzle. Like genuinely. Like look look at the, look at this. Look at this. Okay, boom. There we go. Okay. All right. All right. And that's that's all I needed. And then I push this forward. And then I push this in this direction. Okay. It's it's literally just basic movement. Oh wait. Wait, okay, where do I go from here? Wait, <laughs> Wait! Wait, that, that is not fair. That is not fucking fair. What? What, dude? Okay, actually, wait. Maybe, maybe I need to, like... Maybe what I need to do is, like, leave that block over there. And then just kind of leave it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna assume that's what we have to do. Okay. Fuck off, man. Fuck off, Firefly. I fucking hate these Fireflies, bro. Their patterns are so hard to predict. Genuinely. Okay, that one was definitely not me. I should have paid more attention. Sorry, Firefly. Okay, 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 wait. Oh, shit, wait, no! No, now I get it, now I get it. Fuck, okay. Okay, I got, I got that completely wrong. Wait, wait, okay, now I know what to do, okay. Holy shit. By the way, Hawking, you were right, you were right. I wasn't reading chat, but yeah, you were right about that. Um, yeah, I need to move the spark. Oh, fuck, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna die. I, I'm actually going to run out of health, oh my god. But wait, no. No, no, okay, okay, so. What I needed to do. Okay, and I'm gonna let you move there. Okay. Let's push this. Alright, alright. Push this back here so I can move on it. Fuck that. Oh, wait, no. Okay, there we go. You've got it. That is so mean. That is so mean! That's so mean! What?! Dude! Okay, but I did the puzzle. I did the fucking puzzle. Okay? I did the puzzle correctly. <laughs> that the fucking puzzle was easy, bro. The fireflies fucked me up. Okay? Okay? <laughs> that, none of that shit was on me, bro. That was on the fucking fireflies, man. I did the puzzle. That puzzle was fucking finished, bro. I'm gonna come back to that fucking puzzle, and I'm gonna get it done immediately, okay? And and fucking watch me, bro. And, and like, you will see, that was where the puzzle ended. That was where the puzzle would have ended if I didn't get killed there, okay? Not okay. The fuck you want, bro? The fuck you want, man? Okay, okay, wait. Wait a minute. Wait a minute right here. Okay, what the fuck did I do last time? Okay, wait. Actually, wait, I turned that source off, right? Okay, good, I did. Okay, I was just making sure I turned off my, my, uh... <laughs> I, was, I just had to make sure I turned off one of my sources earlier. Okay, um, alright. Okay, okay, fuck, what did I do here? What did I... <laughs> God damn it, I already forgot. Okay, fuck, um, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay? Okay. Fuck, that isn't okay. Never mind. <laughs> That's the memory of a goldfish. This is a complicated puzzle, okay? Come on, man. <laughs> okay, wait. Wait a minute, wait a minute right here. Okay, uh, fuck, okay, okay. I got this, I totally got this, guys. I totally got this. I am very sane, okay? I'm completely sane. I'm pretty mellow, actually. That, I think, you know, like, I'm I'm just completely mellowed out with Flying Frogger at the moment. I don't, I don't think there's anything to be concerned with. 
fuck, wait. Wait, no, I'm being completely wrong. What am I even on here? You see, the thing is, I did this puzzle once. And if I could do it once, then I could just keep replaying what I did that one time. And then find out what was so good about it. Wait, fuck. Wait, no, I did that wrong. <laughs> or actually, I don't know how, how I'd even, like, push that to the side. Never mind. Okay, I might be doing this right. No, I'm, okay, I'm definitely trying. I'm, I'm definitely rewatching that one clip again. Okay, give me a moment. Dul man, dul fuck. Oh my god, how do I pronounce that? Dulmari underscore creations. Hello, hi, welcome to the stream. How are you fucking feeling, my man? <laughs> I was not losing my mind, bro. I was doing so well. Okay, I w I was doing so well that I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna like quickly replay that one part um where I actually. Puzzle, cause I, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not fucking going through this again. I'm not like going through this entire thing. Um, okay, and all right, all right, okay, 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 okay. Wait a minute. Wait a motherfucking minute. Okay, wait. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, this is looking pretty good. This is looking really, this is looking really damn good, man. Okay. Okay, let me just, let me just, like, right here, right now, genuinely. Because I don't, I don't think I have any confidence in, um, in Hawking, like, randomly reactivating my brain. So, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, like, keep replaying that clip, because I don't wanna, I don't wanna, like, pull together my three brain cells to, like, actually get this puzzle finished. So, um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not fucking, I'm not fucking with that, bro, I'm not fucking with that. You know you can play um, Halo 2 online. But you're like more OG. Oh yeah, right. Uh, Insignia is it? Yeah, yeah, I've heard of that. Yeah, no. I actually I did buy Halo 2. I have not played it yet. Um, I'm probably gonna stream it at some point. I don't know. It depends on like. Okay, it depends on like how I can how I can stream it because. <laughs> Let me be real. Some of my Halo streams are like some of the worst performing uh, live streams I have ever done. So it's like, okay, bro, do I want to stream this again? Is that is that a risk I want to take? Um, yeah. So I don't know. I I will probably like stream Halo 2 at least once. You literally just did this puzzle, yeah, with a guide. Okay. <laughs> okay, and then this is about to fuck me over. Okay. Oh, f I literally did the. <laughs> I did the exact same fucking mistake. Oh my god! Wait, wait, no, no! What the fuck? No! Oh my god! I cannot believe. <laughs> I just did that mistake. I literally okay. God fucking damn it! Okay, 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 okay. No more mistakes this time. I'm doing it correctly. Uh. Okay, wait. So, so no more uh, Dolmari creations when you're on Insignia. Just strictly Dolmari games. All right, I respect that. <laughs> Frogger Ancient Shadows Xbox Live capabilities are. <laughs> Dude, I fucking wish. I fucking wish this game had online support. To be honest. Dude. Dude, I would fucking love to play Frogger Ancient Shadow online. Dude, didn't they like bring back like the the fucking like Mario uh just Mario Bros DS online? Well, not on like online the multiplayer, and then they like made that a dedicated online mode. Okay, yeah, uh, so I got hit there. That's fine. I don't care. But look at that! Look at that! That was the end of the puzzle. Okay, that was the end of the puzzle. Oh god! Now we got these things poking out of the floor. I do not like them. I never fucking like these things. Ugh. My name is different because uh, my name used to be Domari Games at the time. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, so they don't allow you to like change your names and shit? That's weird. Yeah. No, it wasn't. That was the end of the puzzle. You can tell because the puzzle is over. Oh, wait, fuck, wait. Oh my god, I didn't know where to go. <laughs> okay. Oh god, they give you no time to think here. Okay. Woo. 
Because the la the last level was genuinely so easy. Like they they added so many extra health items. Okay, like the the level started off completely like unfair and like terribly designed. But like <laughs> in the second you got to be fucking me. They make they make me restart the that fucking button. No, no I'm restarting the stage. Fuck that. No, fuck that, bro. Just fuck that, man. What the fuck, dude? That's crazy. <laughs> okay, um, alright. Alright, okay. Okay, here we are, here we are, here we are, okay. Okay, please. Please, dude. Please. Okay, like the puzzle. Wait, I think I'm trying this level. So I've only tried this level like I think twice or thrice. I don't think I've tried this puzzle that many times. Um, yeah, genuinely. So I, <laughs> especially like the puzzle later in the stage, I I I never did that. Like the segment I was just in, um, that was like that was completely new to me. Like I I had not reached that part of the stage yet. So. Nah. I I did not understand it through the stage. Okay, wait. Okay, 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 okay. And I'm I'm again I'm using my own guide here. Cause like I'm just I'm just not bro. I'm just not going for that at all. Okay, okay, wait, so Okay, 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 wait, so Alright, beautiful. That is beautiful. That is also beautiful. Okay, I'm not, cause like I don't wanna I don't wanna waste time on this one fucking puzzle, and I'm oh wait that's it I did that so quickly and then I drowned no no fuck that fuck that dude fuck that are you kidding me are you actually kidding me no but like that puzzle could be done so quickly what the fuck <laughs> if I actually like use Actually, no, if I had more brain cells, then I could actually, like, get that puzzle done, like, so quickly, legit. Dude, like, when you actually know what to do, that puzzle is, like, so fast. Otherwise, no. No, dude. Okay. Fuck you. Fuck you, Firefly. Just, like, completely, like, you know, you aren't even voiced by, by David Spade. I don't like you. I was up the mic for the OG Xbox people. <laughs> we we need we need more we need more crunchy mic setups, you know? I don't I don't want anyone with like actually high quality mics. I want people with like the crunchiest mics available. Frog rank to chat fucking never. No. Don't don't even don't even like don't even joke about it, man. Don't even joke about that, bro. <laughs> never. Never dude. Okay, wait. Is that it? Okay, yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah, this puzzle is actually pretty easy. Yeah, this puzzle is easy. I don't know what the fuck I was on that. <laughs> no, that puzzle is so simple. Like, I like look at how quickly I did that. That like that puzzle. Holy shit, that's, dude. No, I'm really, I'm really hoping that that's not like, that's not me being like, fucking like sped. I I hope that's like a genuinely difficult puzzle when you're not like. <laughs> when you don't already know what you're supposed to do. <laughs> because g no fucking way. No fuck. Like, I spent so long on that puzzle, and then it just, it just beat in, like, a couple of seconds. What the hell? Actually. Okay. Okay, so what is the pattern here? What is the pattern? Okay. Okay, that's good to know. That is very good to know. Oh fuck, wait. <laughs> fuck, wait, no! No, I wanted to rotate first! Damn it, wait! No. God! Fuck! Okay, okay, wait, wait, no, we're gonna try this shit again. Fuck. <laughs> uh. Okay, there we go. Okay. Uh.
Yeah, there we go. I should have waited. I should have waited, to be honest. I should have, like, jumped to that platform earlier. God damn it. Okay, thank fuck. Thank fuck, bro. Okay, and then... Oh, fuck. <laughs> how do I even dodge that? How do I... Like, I, how... Bro, what? <laughs> if you thought um, AV was annoying, the, um, and old, just wait until you find meet the. Co wait, what the? F what language is that from, bro? What fucking 80s ass sci-fi movie did you pull that? What? Coaxial cable? Is that real? <laughs> I really, I really hope that I'm not like. Sounding like an absolute dumbass not knowing what that is like you, you guys you guys don't know what a coaxial cable is, right? That sounds like a Pokemon Yes, it's real. Okay What uses it though? Okay, there we go there we fucking go, okay Oh shit, okay Who boy who bo okay? Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. No, I don't want to <laughs> Fuck, wait. No, I need I need so much timing for that. Dude, what? Oh fuck. Okay. I don't even know like what cuz there are things off screen that I will need to like improvise. Shit, cuz I know there's a hazard in front of me, right? Okay, that's le that's less bad. That is that is a lot less bad. Okay. <laughs> Damn it. My timing was a bit off. Okay. Wait, that's it. <laughs> yes. There we. Okay. Wait, what? Oh, what the fuck? That's not the end of the stage. What? I was excited there for a second. I was actually happy, dude. What? What the fuck? Dude, what? Oh my god! Dude! Oh my god, I thought that was the end of the stage. Oh, what the fuck? Ah! Oh my god! Dude! Dude, no! No, what? Ah! Okay. Oh, <laughs> I'm not happy. <laughs> I'm so not happy. Dude, you had so many... You had so many full health restores. Oh my god, there we go. Speak of the motherfucking wooden devil. There we... Okay, I'm happy. I'm happy again. Okay, this is amazing. I'm so... I am doing so great at this stage. Ah, oh, we got a berry section. I don't care. I don't care about the berry section. I do not care. Okay. Oof. Okay. Oh, that's great. That's fucking great, man. I don't even know what to say, bro. Ooh, boy. Uh, what's the lore of this game? Okay, so, so, um, so, Frogger, right? This is a frog, and then he has, um, he has a girlfriend, and, uh, her name is Lily, right? She, she's Frogger, but pink, with a red bow tie. Um, and, uh, I'm not joking. Um, and basically, so, um, she's like, hey, Frogger, there's this weird, uh, like, shadowy figure I found, and then Frogger, um, she's like, okay, I'll go after it, and then he tries to look after it for a while, and then he finds out that there's this, like, evil crocodile guy named Dr. Wani, that one chat member really wants to fuck, that multiple chat members really want to fuck, actually, and then, um, they, they, um, go on an adventure, and Frogger, like, Finds the shadowy figure who's this like uh who's this like blue lizard named Ignuous and uh and they become like really good friends and yeah that's that's it.
that's the lore of this game. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Why do, why do I have, like, the, the, the tired, like, de depressed voice already? This, this game has already taken so much out of me, and it's only been, like, half an hour. The lore is that Frogger hates minorities and... So <laughs> Frogger can't kill people, though. He can't. Well, he actually, he kills a ghost one time. There's that. Yeah. I still can't believe, because they're like, if, if there's enemies that, like, a standard punch or kick won't do, then it's like, I, I've never been able to do, like, any punches or kicks. What, what are you on? Okay. Okay, so I can jump over there, right? Okay, there we go. Thank fuck. Are these ribs? Is that, like, a rib cage? What? Okay. And that's the teleporter. That's not the end of the stage. Oh, you... You you fucking tease. You tease. Oh, my... Two chests just out of reach, bro. And then that's the end of the area. Oh, my God. Igdus, hello. This is this is the edgy uh, blue lizard. Okay, the gate. Okay. Gatekeeping. I'm counting on you. Okay, we need to beat the Twin Towers. Okay, I got this. Got leave this. We're like four years late, but that's that's all good. All right, leave it to me, my main man. Okay. All right. The gay key. No. <laughs> that's not what I said, but sure. <laughs> he, yeah, he does eat flies and bugs. Um, and actually, there's a side mode where you can collect froggers, so I don't know what that means. Uh, like tails, if, uh, like lore wise. We've gotta do a frogger lore deep dive. But like, yeah, the stage is actually getting a lot easier now. Like, I didn't get hit an entire like I didn't get hit at a single point through that last segment. See, guys, I'm good at frogger. I'm good at frogger. It, it, it is exactly what you said, you delightful frogger. What, what does that mean? Okay, there we go. I Like, what even are these? What even are these things poking out of the ground, by the way? I know they make me uncomfortable, but I don't know anything else. Okay. That's good. Ooh. Ooh, I don't like that. Oh, okay, wait. Spike, that spikes don't look like that. They, like these look like they have flesh. Okay, it's disgusting. Worms, disgusting worms. But yeah, sure, why not? I'll let, I'll let Hawking be the right one, because I think, um, either, either Hawking is, like, I think Hawking is just, like, the intelligent one, because they, they gave me extra brain cells that I needed in order to do the puzzle earlier. You call them spikes? So do you have names for, like, every, like, common enemy in this game? <laughs> I, I think the only one, I, I'll have to take Fourth Knower for this, but, like, Fourth Knower does know a fourth of things, so, like, I'll have to, like, accept that. Um, that, like, apparently the, um, the, the, the crocs from earlier are, like, called demi-crocs because they're, like, smaller. Stephen Hawking, yeah. <laughs> Fuck it, sure. Oh, dude, why do you have to set it up like this? What was the most toxic Xbox Live COD lobby you've ever encountered? I have, I'm not a COD player, I apologize. Um, I, I I do own Call of Duty 3, but I've never played it online. Fuck. How the fuck am I gonna get through this? Wait, what? Wait, what? 
What? I'm so confused. No, actually, I'm so confused. What? How do I do this? Okay. Yeah, no. I tried. <laughs> okay, okay. No, but that's that's progress though. That that was fucking that was fucking progress, okay? I was getting I was getting farther. <laughs> I was doing I was doing a lot better than stage. You're a COD enjoyer, yeah. That's why you're based, dude. That's why you're based. Speed run time exactly, bro. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. This is good. This is actually oh wait no actually wait no I got that wrong. I got that wrong. I got that very wrong. Okay, but I'm gonna wait until this guy does his thing first because he is an annoying bitch and I want him to be skinned alive. Okay, no, I don't want I don't want things to get skinned alive. That's that's bad. That's that's a bad thing. That that's 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 a morally um bad thing to think about. I shouldn't have those thoughts. No, that's bad. Frogger doesn't make me want to hurt people. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to hurt anyone. I, I. I. feel. I feel the need to just like clarify that for a quick moment. That I have. I have no intentions of harm people. <laughs> Frogger. Frogger. Uh, gives me no. No desire to do um, anything of that matter. And there we go. The puzzle is done. That's it. That like I I did did not did not even need the guide, bro. Boobs, am I right, guys? Man, titties, bazoinka doinks, Gloria from Happy Feet. I don't know. <laughs> you guys want to know something funny? Um, so Cinder the Dragon from The Legend of Spyro slash Skylanders. Um, so, <laughs> I really, I really want to make this joke in a video, um, when I, like, actually make my Legend of Spyro a new beginning review. Uh, what I want to do for that is I want to, uh, reference, uh, oh, wait, no, wait, no, I was about to make a very bad mistake over there. I was about to not do something. Give me a Pokemon, I gotta do something real quick. Okay, I, I, want, I want to make a joke about the fact that, like, um, Legend of Spyro fans, um, uh, like, were like complaining about uh, <laughs> Cinder's design in Skyland is right, and one of their one of their main complaints was that like apparently it looked like they gave Cinder boobs in the um, in that iteration of her design, right? And um, <laughs> I want to make a joke about the fact that not only um, does Cinder's model from uh, fuck what game was it uh, from Legends by Our New Beginning in like the cutscenes already kind of look like that too which is a uh, story where she is a kid. Uh, but also, um, knowing the Legend of Spyro fandom, I know for a fact that, like, Legend of Spyro fans have no issue with Cinder being depicted with breasts. <laughs> so, you know, um, I feel like I feel like it's kind of a, kind of a, kind of a basic drug, man, my man. Yeah, Frogger, Frogger is such a great guy. He just makes me want to, like, rip people's spinal cords out sometimes. And you know what? You, you want to know the thing? I think it is completely healthy to want to rip people's spinal cords out. I think, like, everyone should have that one moment per day where they just go, You know what? I want to rip someone's spinal cord out. And, like, you know, if they don't have anyone who wants to get their spinal cord ripped out, then that's all good. It just means that, like, I don't have to rip anyone's spine out. And that's, you know, like... Sometimes, sometimes I just I just want the urge, but I don't want to like follow through with it. Um, so I, I'm uh, on on those days. I'm kind of just like, okay, I'm not gonna go for that. All right, there's gonna be a full health restore soon, so I don't really care. Well, actually, no, there's gonna be something that gives me four HP, but that's basically a full health restore because I have two HP and math. What the fuck? 
Oh, right. <laughs> Fucking stupid. Ugh. I'm not gonna lie, man. Um, Cinder kind of looks trash in Legend Spyro, goopy ahead and all that. Do you mean do you mean that um, before or after she's uh, she's a giant uh, emo thing? Yeah, but I think I think Cinder is like oh, I think Cinder's always been ugly. I don't think there's a single version of Cinder that isn't ugly. That might be a hot take, but I think every single depiction of Cinder has always been ugly. I think the only one that actually looks appealing is her design in. Um, in like Dawn of the Dragon, um, yeah, like I've seen, I've seen like, um, you know, her. Well, I've seen like, I've seen like in pre-rendered cutscenes, her, um, her design after she turns good, and like I've seen her design. Uh, I think I've seen, I think I've seen like a screenshot of her in game, um, like uh, two years ago, and like I, I just think that she doesn't look that good. I, I think she's never looked that good. I, the bad kind of ugly. It it's not like stylistically ugly. And like, <laughs> Sparks calls her sexy at one point, so it's like, I don't fucking know. <laughs> and like, I don't, like, okay, that just seems like such a weird thing to make as a, like a, as a joke for the game, so I'm not sure. For me, the bad guy, definitely, yeah. Cause like, I, I like, I like Spyro being ugly, that's the thing. Um, cause I grew up with, uh, like, you know, Skylander Spyro, and he's, uh, like ugly as sin and I, I like I think um legend Spyro is probably my favorite Spyro as it, actually is it the official name young Spyro yeah um so I, I like that version of Spyro the most um yeah I gotta I gotta say like you know <laughs> it balances the ugly with the cuteness and I think it, it just leads for a very like um you know appealing design What? Uh, yeah, in one of the, the cutscenes, um, <laughs> uh, like, it's basically, it's okay, so Spyro is learning about Cinder's backstory, right? And then Sparks is just like, oh, no, no, Spyro's just like, okay, why is she so, so, and then Sparks goes, big, evil, monstrous, sexy, oh, wait, <laughs> did I say that, tee hee, uh, so, uh, <laughs> so random, guys. I, I really don't like, um, Sparks calling her that, because it doesn't really fit, like, um, how I imagine the, the character are going. Cause I feel like I feel like Sparks character arc could have been handled so well. Cause I think I genuinely think like unironically Sparks is the best character. Um if he was written like slightly differently, he would've been perfect. Yeah, yeah, um, basically, so, in the game, uh, they kind of ruined this by having, like, a trailer play in the main menu that, like, blatantly just shows her design, but throughout the game, they, like, slowly build up her design, where, like, um, at first, you only hear her, like, flying over the two main characters, which I didn't really understand what was going on when that happened, um, and then you see her, like, from the distance, and, like, every stage, you see her a little bit closer, and then by the end, it's like, oh my god, it's her, bro, it's, it's, it's her! It's, 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 it's the, it's the emo dragon, no way. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. The writers wanted you to think the character is sexy. And not only is the character a lizard, but it's like, she's 12 in that game. <laughs> so it's like, bro, what? <laughs> yeah, I, I do not. I, I don't, I don't like, I don't like that. I really don't like that. And like, yeah, on one hand, it is a cartoon character. It doesn't matter, but it's it's still gross <laughs> to me. <laughs> Especially because it's a lizard. What the fuck?
there's actually no way to do this puzzle, I swear to god. Oh wait. Okay, because the thing is, right, all the spikes are on a slightly different offset. So you just have to wait until they're, like, perfectly aligned. Sparks is a bug, yeah. <laughs> Sparks is, in fact, a bug. Uh, I don't like that. I really... Uh... Yeah, nah. The game is, like, okay. I... I... <laughs> I'm really hoping the game has like a massive blow up in the, in the future because, okay. It has, okay, Sparks and Spyro are pretty good characters. Um, they could have been done a lot better, but like, you know, they're fine. Uh, and then you have, like, you know, gameplay that is incredibly repetitive. And the story is like your generic hero's tale um, type beat, like, from beginning to end. What a new beginning, yeah. So, um, I feel like uh, they, they better do something interesting with the sequel. Because I feel like if the sequel is just, like, Cinder going, I was bad in the last game, and then, like, Spyro turning um, evil, um, as in... What I, what I mean by him turning evil is, is that he becomes black. Um, and uh, I, I'm, I'm not even joking. I'm pretty sure that's, the, that's one of the plot points, I think. Um, he turns, like, edgy and shit, and it's probably going to be really cool. Uh, I think Eternal Night is the one I know the least about, so that makes me pretty excited to play it. Because, okay, people say, like, oh, yeah, the new beginning was, like, uh, it was, it was like, an alright start to the series. And then people say, like, Dawn of the Dragon, like, kind of messed up a lot of stuff. Um, it was rushed, and it was, like, done during, like, the Activision buyout. Um, so, apparently, it's pretty mid there. But then it's, like, okay. So, Eternal Light has to be that sweet spot, right? That has to be, like, when the game actually becomes good. Oh man, that dragon's pretty hot, man. Oh, ooh, I sure do love that. Like, <laughs> I I feel like I feel like you can't make you can't make a non anthropomorphic dragon sexy unless you've been like watching way too much porn. <laughs> unless you've been watching like disturbing amounts of scaly porn, I feel like you would like no one would actually find like Cinder attractive. Then again, then again, I think she literally has like over a thousand results on a, on like. Uh, that one website, so you know. Maybe, maybe I'm the wrong one. I don't know. Oh fuck! I did that. I keep, I keep forgetting this one part of the puzzle. God fucking damn it! Okay, wait. And then our game has a better story. I don't know. Yeah. Um. I, I, I think going into the series, I'm pretty sure. Um. The, um, let's see, I think, okay, Dawn of the Dragon is, I think, the one that I know the most about. As in, like, I've seen a lot of gameplay screenshots of it. Um, you know, for better or for worse. That way, fuck. Oh, <laughs> why did I do that? Why did I do that? What the fuck? No. Yeah, um, I've seen, like, the most screenshots of it. And I gotta say, whoa, nice graphics. I gotta get my hands on that game. I... I love the visual style of it. The game looks absolutely beautiful. I, like, honestly, I'm incredibly excited to play it. Um, uh, whenever I get around to it. How do you know that? Um, I, I, I like, okay. <laughs> I, I do I do this a lot usually for bits, but like I will occasionally like have to like not have to I never have to but like I'll, I'll check like what um, <laughs> What results a character has to either prove up like usually to prove a point um, and um, Example like dr. Wani I had to search up dr. Wani on there to prove that no one is drawing porn of him And I was right. No one draws porn of dr. Wani um, or maybe I'm not looking hard enough. I don't know. Oh, yeah, research. <laughs> no.
experience since I watched it. Yeah, I think. Um, I don't know if I've ever watched a review of it. Um, if so, I probably watched it when I was like 11, so I, I just don't remember anything from it. I do remember watching like a compilation of the cutscenes. I, I think I didn't even know like what the series was at the time. I must have been like nine years old. And this was like when I was like a huge Skylanders fan, so I must have like been watching Skylanders videos and like randomly got it my recommended. And I didn't really understand what was happening. Um, all I remember was um, Spyro and Cinder being trapped in a crystal cave. Um, and, uh, I don't know, like, what that was for, but, um, uh, yeah, that was, that was a thing that happened. Uh, I'm, oh God, I'm trying, I'm trying to think of, like, anything else that's happened. I, I don't, I don't, if anyone knows the context of that, do not tell me. <laughs> it's probably from, uh, The Eternal Night, because it's, yeah, I remember it being, like, the, the young design, but I don't know. You gotta be fucking near me. But yeah, if you were like 10 to 14, would you have uh, thought that the game series was great? Absolutely! Absolutely, are you kidding me? Because after playing Skylanders Imaginators, right? Like, I was so excited for Skylanders Imaginators um, after playing Superchargers, because I love Superchargers. And um, Imaginators, it got me like, it was so, it was such like, I, okay, I didn't have the cognitive function to be like aware that the game was ass, right? Um, but like, I, 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 it just didn't feel like as great as the rest of them. And I didn't know why or how. It, the gimmick was great. Um, the gimmick is absolutely phenomenal, but it's like, dude, what the fuck? Um, God damn it, where was I? Okay, yeah. Um, and, you know, like, I. Fuck, why did I lose my train of thought? <laughs> Okay. Uh, God damn it. Okay. So, um, yeah, but I, 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 I watched the cutscenes, right? I was kind of imaginators, and I was playing the game, and I just hated the humor. Like, even at ten years old, I was like, you know, um, Spyro saying, "Huh, strange we can hear each other from this distance." Like, shut the fuck up, man. That's like, that's such lame meta humor. Um, and then I, I feel like I would have loved Legend of Spyro in the beginning. Like, if I played that like the year after playing Spyro's Imaginators, that would have been like my absolute jam. Are you kidding me? Because, like, you know, I wanted something, like, older, something, like, a bit more mature, but I still wanted, like, the cartoony world. I still wanted, like, the fun designs. I still wanted the dragons and all that. So, if The Legend of Spyro New Beginning, like, came out afterwards, then I, that would have been, like, that would have been my thing, dude. I would have loved that. And we get, like, the edgy. Ooh, the, 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 big, the big, like, mysterious cinder. Ooh, this is so crazy. Um, and then, like, actually, right sparks good. Like, yeah, right. Oh yeah, absolutely, absolutely. It is just straight millennial writing all the way. Dude, I think millennial writing might actually be my least favorite thing in the world. Like, it is it is ruining every industry. It's like, yeah, hey, we're not we're not gonna take ourselves seriously. We're not gonna like invest ourselves into the story. And like, dude, the interviews of the of the Skylander of like the developers, they're either like blatantly lying to the interviewer or they completely failed at what they were setting out to do and I don't know which one's worse because they're like oh yeah <laughs> there's a lot of like mysterious ancient power to this and we gotta like represent how that how that strange power is in the story and it's like no you fucking don't you don't do that at all <laughs> yeah, that's that's not even like that that isn't even applicable to the game because like literally the game ends with like a game show parody and it's like okay that doesn't scream mysterious or powerful to me. The game never takes itself seriously. So you're you're lying to the interview to, interviewer to make the game sound better. Like, it's a good game for parents and their kids, but so are all the other ones. So I don't really get the point of that. <laughs> Gixie, that's actually an amazing point, because... Um, it is, it is canon that like there was a chaos clone in Imaginators, but it's not, it's not like chaos, you know. It's like um, it's it's the chaos you play as. That would have been so great though. You gotta be kidding me. I'm gonna look up a guide for this next time I get there, actually. Ugh. 
Don't you like references, quirky little totally random humor? No, I hate it. <laughs> I I think um I like references in in comedy, but um not really. Like when it okay, if it's if it's indie, then I like references, right? If it's like indie media, but if it's like a massive, you know, like big budget thing, then it's like no, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna like that. That's always so lame. Like if it, if it's a, if it's like a creator like throwing jabs at themselves, then yeah, I love that. But if it's like if it's like a big corporation like kind of just like pointing and laughing at their, at themselves, then no, I never laugh at that. Cuz like there's so many like, you know, um example like throwing your password under the bus for a joke, like that's funny. But if you're like if you're doing that and like you're a massive corporation, that's like that's kind of big fuck you to like um, to everyone who worked on those past projects. Um, using that as an example, of course, just like, you know, but comedy in general, I just, I just feel like that's so much work. Remember Star Wars? It's, it's so funny looking at, like, uh, people talk about 2000s media, because, like, everything was in reference to Star Wars. Everything was just meta jokes referencing Star Wars. Beautiful. Remember the 80s? They literally do that sometimes, like, actually. <laughs> hey, you remember this thing? Oh yeah, and then they they have a fourth wall joke where he's like, "Oh yeah, earlier in life, I mean, <laughs> earlier earlier in the wait wait no fuck wait no he says earlier earlier in the games oh wait no huh earlier earlier in life I mean <laughs> ah, shut the fuck up shark then I don't care <laughs> uh, I hate I hate meta humor I hate meta humor so much except for when I do it it's funny when I do it. I think I think Scott the Waz, you know, the the greatest comedian and philosopher of our time, um, said it the best. Um, you know, y your joke should be like if you're doing a joke that's a reference to something, then the joke should be funny even to people who don't get the reference. And um, I, I don't know if you use Spaceballs as an example, but Spaceballs is a great example. <laughs> then again, I haven't watched Spaceballs since I was like seven, so. Because okay, getting hit it, it it let me like okay, it stopped me from using my tongue right, and when I stopped using my tongue, because I was like I was holding the the D pad to my right right, <laughs> so then what when it like removes the tongue it just makes me like fall off a ledge, dude. That one first person shooter game high on life for example of that we're written by. Yeah, exactly. Um, uh, all I've seen is like out of context clips, so I can't really critique it that well. Um, but like, <laughs> the the clips I've seen of High on Life are just not funny. It's like, hee hee hi, you're the player of this game. We're acknowledging you. Isn't that isn't that completely humorous? That's so funny. And then it's like, oh oh, oh yeah, and I think they reference like the show Code Lyoko at some point. This is like a hey guys, remember this thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, just it's just referencing something for the sake of referencing something. I don't get it. Yeah, no, but reference humor is a complete disease. Avoid it at all costs. Oh. Oh, I don't like that. Okay, allow me to speed run this real quick. Never mind, that's not speed running. That's just like waiting. Allow me to rip wait run real quick. Hey guys, you remember this? <laughs> remember remember this thing guys? Guys, guys, you remember you remember Skylanders? That that is like there are so many videos. Oh my it's so funny. It's so funny. Okay, if you're a YouTuber and like you ran out of ideas, there are a couple of things you can you can like make videos about right you can make a video um being like hey do you remember the connect or you can make a video um being like hey remember skylanders 
every YouTuber that like talks about video games, even or like just like general like old nostalgia media, they always do it. They always like make a one-off video that's like, what happened to the twice life genre? Every YouTuber's done it, and it's so annoying. Like, do genuinely just stop making those videos. You, you're adding nothing to the table. <laughs> there is like everything that could possibly be said in a video that you're making has already been said. Just stop talking. Just like revoke your speaking rights. Like, think of a gaming YouTuber, and they've probably done it. At, at least, like, not not the ones that like you know like do like not like let's players or anything. Even then, a lot of like, well, like the kids let's players do that. Like Sandy Cat, I played Skyhunters, but not no. It's just that complete like, oh yeah, I've run out of ideas. Yeah, like I can I can get that for Spot the Boss. I think that's an incredibly honorable thing to do. Um, but like for anyone else, no. It's just like nostalgia. It's just complete nostalgia baiting. And also, like no matter what, Scott the Waz always adds substance to what he talks about. So I don't, I don't mind if Scott the Waz does it because he he always adds substance to these things. But like he, it, there's there's never a point where you can like, you know. Um... Sorry, I'm just focusing for a bit. M M, what the fuck? Yeah. There's there's never a point in those videos where it's where in like most videos where it's just like oh man this guy's adding so much they will talk about it because it's it's always it's like they're always formatted the exact same they always have to make a joke about like about um about like putting your parents into credit card debt you know they always have to like <laughs> make a joke about like Activision being greedy and that being like the downfall of the franchise and like dude I I always hate it when people like critique major corporations being like oh yeah. But we got to make money. Because, like, that's that's how companies work. That's how every company works. <laughs> you know? Like, unless, unless it's, like, a genuine, like, charity or, like, a foundation or whatever. Like, that's always how these things are formatted. That's the goal. Make money. That's, like... <laughs> it's, a, it, like, this is... That's that's capitalism, bro. Like, I, I don't get it. And like, you could say like, oh yeah, they're doing it for a joke. Well, the joke isn't funny, the, like, cause like everyone makes the joke. It's a joke that we've all heard before. So like, stop repeating that. Imagine not liking money, yeah. <laughs> like, okay, if it, if it were up to me, we would all be like, we would all be like in the woods hunting animals. And then like, I would be like over there, like, I don't know, um, like carving um, like hentai into like wood or something. Um, you know, but, but that's, that's not the world we're in. We're in the world where I play Frogger, okay? Deal with it, man. <laughs> it's always the dumbest thing, though. Yeah. I mean, like, I don't, I don't want to sound, I don't want to sound like I'm being, like, too negative here. Because it really doesn't matter. Like, you're making a video, and it's like, that's, that's your investment of time. Like, go for it. And, like, even if you're doing, like, you know, there, there's worse ways to, like, um, be like you know completely like uninspired with your content and you know especially if it's like something you're nostalgic, you know, nostalgic towards like that's fine but it's just like dude everyone's made that video already you're like repeating so much basic information yeah that's why i i made a dedicated post about this but i don't want to fuck nostalgia baiting nostalgia baiting does well but like it it, it leaves people like not uh, subscribing to you for like you, it's at least people subscribing to you for like um, what you're nostalgia baiting for. And it gets you subscribers, it gets you views, but it's like, at what cost? To be honest, I've grown tired of capitals for jokes because um, you have to spend money. You know? <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly, dude. Capitalism jokes just aren't funny anymore. That stay longer than it should have. I'm gonna say it did, bro. Oh! Oh my god, that was amazing. That was amazing. <laughs> Dude, that's awesome. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Okay, okay, please, 
Please, please, please, please have mercy on me. Please, yes! Ah! <laughs> oh, it's so beautiful! Oh! 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 Oh, that's so beautiful! Oh! Oh my god. Oh my god, that's so beautiful. That's actually so beautiful. <laughs> oh my yes! Thank you! Thank you! <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Oh. Oh my god, that's beautiful. Oh, oh my god, hold me, Frogger, hold me. Oh, okay, okay, sorry. Oh, I'm so happy right now. This is it, the boss. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I gotta mentally prepare myself. One sec. I wasn't moaning, I wasn't moaning. I was, I was just, uh, I was expressing gratitude towards the game, okay? Fuck. <laughs> Oh shit, that, that was badass, what the fuck? That's, that's, that's cool, bro, that's actually so cool. <laughs> Ugh. Sorry, sorry, Frogger just got me. Got me tripping, bro. You're expressing gratitude, alright? <laughs> okay. Barry. Hi, Barry, I'm gonna guard with armor. Everything sucks. I heard a story from someone at the surface about a big man with a large shield. The big man was pretty weak if his shield was taken away. Everyone, no matter how big, has a weak spot. Take care, Barry. Thank you for that, Barry. You know what? You know what? I'm 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 fully going through my character arc. I no longer hate you. I just incredibly despise you, Barry. All right, guys. That is a beautiful lesson. <laughs> If there is someone who is tougher than you, just kill them. Use your tongue on them. It's pretty easy. Why well, send this letter though? Um, I think I think the reason she's sending this letter is because she's a psychic and she knows the next boss is going to have a shield. And sorry, actually one second. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna hydrate myself real quick. My throat is incredibly dry from yelling that much and moaning. Okay. Holy shit, that felt so good. Drinking water, that is. And finishing the stage. Nah, that was that was good though. That was that was actually a really good stage. I'm I'm pretty happy with that stage. Okay, final boss. Final boss. Imagine getting a letter from a friend that he talks about how he saw a butterfly and taught uh and it taught him how that flies by. <laughs> <laughs> Have I ever learned a moral lesson from something? Um, I was I was I was 12 this one time and I ordered a cinnamon roll and I was never the same. <laughs> uh, anyways, um, oh God, what moral lessons have I got from really simple things? Happy feet, the movie, no, dancing, no. That's not simple enough. And besides, I've already talked about those in the art post. What, what's the thing I've never- Is that the Assassin's Creed logo? Wait, what? Wait, what the- Wait, what are- What are- What the fuck are- <laughs> What- What season from Digimon are you guys from? Hello? Okay. God damn, all right. What was it that cinnamon roll? 
it, it wasn't about what was put in it, bro. It wasn't about what was put in it. It was, it was about it was about the experience, Use man. Your to take away his shield. He'll be weak if he has no defense. All right. Okay. If you're ever in a tough situation, just know you can always use your tongue on your enemies. Okay, partner. I got this guy. I'll leave the other one up to you. Yeah, tell him, Frogger. <laughs> Why is this now an anime fight? <laughs> Frogger's an anime. What are you talking about? Okay. I'm gonna use my tongue on you! Okay. Oh, that's disgusting. OH WAIT, WHAT THE FUCK WAS THAT?! WHAT?! <laughs> oh, okay, so it doesn't matter if you jump over it, you still get hit. Lovely. Fuck. Okay, you know what, you know what, I'm in the early stages of this, this is okay. I'm surprised I'm not fighting Wani right now, though. <laughs> Always use your tongue and your friends, too. Yeah, I'm gonna be using my- <laughs> I'm gonna be using my tongue on, uh, on Ignuous after this. Ugh. Alright, so we're against the big fucker and the, the lean fucker with the sword, okay. I like these designs. So like, if Ignuus was part of like a Wani tribe, then like these don't look very Wani to me, right? Okay, let me use my tongue on you. What the fuck was that? Alright, there we go. Oh, fuck. I'm not into getting electrocuted. Fuck. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Alright, only one shield left. I only have to use my tongue on it one more time. What the fuck was that? Okay, what now? Oh, okay. Oh, no! Wait, what the fuck? Oh, shit! Oh, God! It snapshot off Wish! Please tell me the final boss will be after these two knuckles. I hope so. I hope so, dude. I, I, will, I would be pretty anticlimactic if the final boss was just like... These two fuckers. I really hope we get just get like a, a a final final boss after this. I hope there's not an entire other world. Ugh. Braga, leave the I want to be okay. Thank you. Oh yeah. By the way, I'd like to, I'd like you guys to know that I was originally going into the stream yesterday. But um, I had a DND session to do, and in that DND session, I'm actually playing as Ignuous. <laughs> like, like the, like the fucking, the, the. Um... Oh, there we go. Oh. Oh, I could, I could just do that. <laughs> okay. I'm not complaining. Oh shit! Wait. Oh, oh fuck. Oh my god. Snapshot, you're supposed to be the one with the bow and arrow. What the fuck is this, bro? Ah! Oh, that's it? Oh, no. He has to shield again. Oh, that's... Okay, get over Get over here. Get over Get... Get over here. Get... You just... 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 Get... <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that was that isn't very funny. Absolute tag team duo. Oh. Okay. 
okay, and that's it. I found the strat. Come at me, bitch. Come at me. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, bro. <laughs> oh my god, no one playtested this. Nobody playtested this. Okay, there we go. Alright, okay, good. And and then and then you come back. Yeah, this might actually be the easiest boss in the game. <laughs> Why does this have a reverse difficulty curve, bro? <laughs> uh yeah, take that you fat buck. Oh my god. Dude. Tubby bastard. Oh my god, I know he's back in then. Um, so now I kill this guy, right? I'm gonna kill you with my tongue. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I don't I don't think anyone played this at this one, that's a thing. Oh no, he's naked now, huh? Because he, he doesn't have a shield, that's so funny. Oh. Oh, that's not very funny. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh my god, that hurt my throat. That actually hurt my throat. Oh, ow. Ow, fuck. Oh my god, that hurt. Ah. Uh, oof, okay. <laughs> okay. No, that's fine. No, that's fine. I'm not I'm not I'm not even I'm not even that mad. Cuz like this is such a, this is such an easy boss. Nice battle formation, guys. So, like... By the way, um, I would just like to mention, while I'm dealing with the shield guy, um, the sword guy is, like, getting dealt with by Ignuous, right? So, like, does Ignuous just shoot him in the head? Like, what ha- like... I- what- 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 what is happening with his side of the fight, dude? Hey, welcome to Boundary Break, where we basically take the camera anywhere we want and we try to find some secrets and new discoveries in some of our favorite games. Today we'll we be looking at the, this one boss fight with Frogger, Ancient Shadow, and Doom's Lair. What happens when Ignuous is on the other side of the screen? Probably just like despawns, to be honest. Yeah, I fumbled. Oh no, that's oh that's sad. Uh oh. Wait, so if he hits you, he just he just like leaves, okay. Oh. So I can just let him hit me at the end. There we go. <laughs> well he doesn't throw hands, he throws tongues, dude. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna use my tongue in your friend now. Okay, there we go. All right, come at me, come at me, boy, man, come at me. I ain't even afraid of you. I ain't even afraid of you, bro. I would just like bring up the fact that like Frogger is technically shooting his tongue directly at his crotch. I like that. <laughs> you can either interpret that as um, a lewd uh, reference, or you can interpret it as um, as Frogger tongue punching for the balls. Whatever you think is funnier. Yeah, no, Ignorance doesn't even have to throw hands, he just looks cool.
Alright, there we go. Pretty easy, my man. And then they switch again. Okay, there we go. Cool. Lovely. That's it. That's 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 all, folks. That's all. Goodbye. That was that was so great. That wow. Thank you for that. Like, what commentary do I even provide now? I think these guys just need to get good. That's the thing. Is that it? Oh my god, that's it. I just have to get hit. That's all. <laughs> they were too heavy for their hoverboards. Fat bitch. All right. Oh, I'm like, oh my god, they're floating now. Oh no, they're they're not. They're th doing the opposite of that. Watch out, the floor's collapsing. It was collapsing the entire stage. What are you talking about? Whoa. Come on, Frogger. Come on, come on, do it, man. No! No, he's gonna die! That's so sad! <laughs> this is an anime! This is- <laughs> This is an anime! Uh, wait, what? Wait, he's black now?! What?! <laughs> oh my god, his mysterious past! Dude! There's more. There's more. There's more. Game isn't over. Okay, that's cool. Okay, but I would love to save my progress. <laughs> Frogger, Frogger, we consider ninja. Okay, I read. I read this before. Um, before. Oh, oh, there's another world. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Yeah, I read this before the cutscene played, um, but this is probably my favorite comment that I've ever gotten um, in any live stream. I don't know um, if this sounds stupid, but what if we had Sega Superstars Tennis, but we're in the devil? I did not play Sega Superstars Tennis. Um, I played Sonic and Sega Ultras Racing, but I would fucking love that, dude. <laughs> I think I think out of all the ideas, I gotta say, Thorn and Dowser playing tennis, that sounds pretty good to me. Although, how many characters... Would you even have in something like that? I mean, I mean, like most people are dead by the end of it, so I don't, I don't think we can play tennis <laughs> unless, unless it's like unless it's like dry bones where like you play their skeletal remains. <laughs> that would that would be so fucked up. Uh, nah, I would love that though. I would actually love um a uh a a Raid in the Water Devil tennis game. Yeah, the boss was like really, really quick. I'm, I'm honestly surprised. Or you can just use spin-off logic and just say like, oh yeah, they're just, they're just alive now. Don't no question it. Yeah, exactly. I, um, I have a strict rule against uh, Timber being evicted as like a reoccurring threat, or like her being evicted in like a mini scenario. But if you're having Rain of the Wooded Devil tennis, you can't have, you can't not have the Wooded Devil. So I think it would probably just be like, I don't know, some kind of like, uh, recreation. Um, that like another mysterious, uh, figure created. Oh my god. <laughs> can you, can you imagine? Can you imagine, like, I, I made a sequel to Rainy the Wooded Devil, but it's just the characters playing tennis. And then like, it's a, it's a fucking tennis tournament created by like, <laughs> by like, uh, 
Rose who's trying to like uh, take the identity of the Wooded Devil. That would be the goofiest thing ever, but that would be amazing. Holy shit. I, I, I'm I not coping. I'm doing so well. Okay. Yeah, look at this. I beat both of these stages. And I did really good. Make it a parody, Randall Devil. Actually, that reminds me. I, I wanted to uh, make... Um, Gixie knows about this idea. I, I can't remember if Gixie or Nifua came up with it, but it was like Randall Woolet Devil, where it was going to be like a sheep um, girl who was going to be like uh, dressing up as Timber. And then Thorn would like resist killing her for like a while but i i decided again like no 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 timber comedy rule rain rain of the wooded tennis match yeah <laughs> have you done a skit of course i did my skits so are you kidding me yeah um frogger turned into a black guy for a second that was cool Okay, I don't think I'm gonna get that far in sealed part, but let's let's just let's just check this shit out, man. Let's just check this shit out. Rain of the Wooded Tennis Match, dude. I can't wait. I might actually draw that. <laughs> like like Dazzler throwing blank tennis. That is. I think that would actually like help with. I think Thorn's reflexes would actually help, right? You know. He's gotta like have that in him. Oh, such a calm start to the stage. I don't like that. Okay, uh, you are a statue. By the way, of course the final ending to this world has to be set in the volcano. I thought the last day was going to be the end, but nope, we got more. Okay, I don't even know what that's supposed to be. Is that like a dragon? That's cool. Oh. Okay. This is, this is actually like... I know I just fucked up there, but this is actually looking pretty easy. Like, okay, never mind. This actually reminds me of Frogger 2 on Xbox Live Arcade, because I actually played Frogger 2 on Xbox Live Arcade. Um, the Lava World is the second world, right? Okay, never mind, this is incredibly hard. Oh, it stops by there, okay. Okay, that makes sense. I, I didn't know, like, what corner it would stop by at. Okay. Yeah, no, like, Frogger, Frogger, um, 2 on Xbox Live Arcade has a stage literally just like this. Uh, actually, in... Oh my god. In, in, uh, in Frogger 2, uh, you actually help out an alien named Pico, and, uh, none of the characters from this series of Frogger games actually makes an appearance. There's no Lumpy or Lily or, uh, Barry or Ignuous, nothing. Not even Dr. Wani. So sad. But, like, it's it's a it's a story without any conflict, right? Like, there's no, like, bad guy in it. There's just, like, there's no, like, world-ending threat. It's just Frogger helping out a little alien dude. Yeah, no, the stage is incredibly difficult. Wani did not show up. We beat up two other crocodiles. I don't know if this is the final area, okay? I thought it was the final area three areas ago. Wait, the Wani BNG? Okay, one sec. Okay. Alright. Wait, fuck no. That's the wrong source. Uh, where is my other source? Okay. Image 21. Nope, that's... That's really old art. What the fuck? No, that's... That's, that's, a, that's another... Of the same art piece by some guy with a coconut who is in this live stream right now. Oh my god, look at this. This is absolutely beautiful. Thumbnail art. Let's go. Sorry, sorry. It, um, it, it, it deprives me of my energy when I play Frogger for this long. So, sorry, my voice is kind of just like. Because I feel like that's how it always is, though. Like, it's always like me screaming for a while, and then I just kind of like lose that later on. Please. Please, dude. Please. Nope. Okay. No, 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 oh my god, okay, now I have to wait for that again. Cool. It is so hard to read chat like this. Oh 
Let's see. They find out a mod gear for PS3. Did Sega Superstar Tennis release on Wii actually? It had to have a uh, had to have up, right? Like why wouldn't it? Um Actually I'm gonna I'm gonna search that up. I I associate uh Sega Superstar Tennis with the Xbox 360, not because I'm an Xbox 360 gamer, but because like there was the arcade bundle that came with it, so I always think of like that console with it. I didn't even know it came on PS3 to be honest. I don't know why it wouldn't though. Um Sega oh wait no fuck wait. Oh wait, yeah, Sega Superstars Tennis. Um we Let's see. Okay, it did release on Wii. Okay, good, yeah. By the way, something I love in Sega Super Stars Tennis compared to like Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing is that in Sega Super Stars Tennis, you have um like <laughs> the version of Beat from Jet Set Radio is the version who appears in Jet Set Radio, um, like the original on Dreamcast, and then in um, Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing, it's Beat from um from oh fuck from Jet Set Radio Future. Which, like, Jet Set Radio Future is just Omega Base, but that's just me. Actually, that does remind me, though. Uh, I've been thinking about this last night. Uh, do you guys remember that animation I did where it was um, Dowser beating my Pokemon Mystery Dungeon OCs and uh, Spike Whitehorn in, like, the Pokemon Mystery Dungeon art style? I want to try that again for, like, my next anniversary. Um, or like somewhere around then, but I don't know like what game style I should emulate. I might try to do it of a 3D game, but that might be, uh, really difficult. How do I, how do I know what pattern this has? What? Dude! Okay. So that only pops by for like a split second. Lovely. That is, that is so great. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> the Legend of Spyro style? Um, that would require me to have like very animated cutscenes, and it would I wouldn't have much of a reference to go off of because like humans never appear in that. There's only like monkeys. Um, and uh, I'm I'm not I'm not <laughs> never mind, I was gonna I was gonna make a really a terrible joke with that though. No. <laughs> fuck that. Uh okay. What the game do you have an attachment to do? That's a good question. I don't know. I think Yokai Watch, maybe. I don't really like, like, because I guess that's that's another RPG, and I feel like I could like emulate the style a lot better because it's just like low poly anime ish style, which I've done anime ish styles before. Oh, uh, what? Sorry, I had to put, put my mic in my mouth for a second, just to, like, just to, like, just just to encapsulate the fucking. Bullshit that is! I'm sorry! I beg your pardon! Bud! Absolute hoser, absolute friend, A. But like, my G, my main homie, you, you expect, you expect getting hit by that thing once. By that thing once. <laughs> Sends me to the last checkpoint. And I haven't encountered any checkpoints as of yet in this stage. So you expect me to restart the entire stage because I got hit by one thing there. Oh my god. That actually pisses me off. Oof. Oh my god. No. No. Just no. Just I. I need a moment. I really need a moment. Guys. Guys. Just like. Just give me a moment here. I. I really need a moment. I. Oh my god. No. I think I'm about to cry. I think I'm actually about to cry. What the fuck is that? There's no irony in my voice right now. That is so depressing. Chemicla, take you pills? No, fuck that. I'm not taking my pills. 
You can't make me. I'm better off without him. <laughs> oh, oh my god, sorry, I had to make that noise. I don't know what that noise was, but I had to make it. I just needed I just needed to like there were there were demons that were like unleashed inside of me that I just needed to take out real quick. Because of Frogger. Dude, what what even was that? What do you, like what what am I playing right now? What am I like what am, what am I actually experiencing? <laughs> oh man. Oh I love I sure do love him and I sure do love him. Frogger. Frogger makes me wanna makes me wanna rip a guy's teeth out. Oh, I sure do love that. I sure do love <laughs> Tying up someone by the neck, <laughs> driving my Ford F-150, <laughs> and driving them across the desert, watching as their skin <laughs> gets peeled off through the sand, rapidly going past them. Ooh, mama. Okay, sorry. I, I don't know what came over me there. There were wooden tiles coming out of that crown, yeah. Uh, that is that is not what Timber sounds like, sadly. You switch to, to a Timber VTuber now. <laughs> uh. Okay, where where am I? Where am I? Where am I right now? Oh yeah, I was talking about Yokai Watch earlier. I think I might actually be able to like recreate the GUI because like in Blender I could probably like add a few filters and like resolution changes, right? And then like just turn it into. Oh my God, that dragon is so cute! Where is that pterodactyl? I can't tell. Oh my God, they're so cute. That is so fucking cute. Oh my God, I love them. I love all three pixels of them. That is adorable, dude. I think she'd stream Hitman or something. Yeah. You know, I think I, I think I understand. I think I understand in what. Okay, in the earlier levels, they would give me like health or stores that would give me four health points. This health store that's in front of me only gives me one health point. So I think the reason why they kept giving me four health points in my health stores was because they wanted me to feel as much agony as possible when I would go to a later stage and see just one, one sliver of health that they're giving me. I cannot express the level of sadism that goes through the developer's heads when making this game. Okay, I gotta put my tongue on that snake over there. That is not a euphemism, that is actually what's happening in this game. Oh! I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Welcome to the rope store. Thanks, I might need that soon. Yo, this is kind of reminding me of like that one stage from Sonic Lost World where it's just your generic evil like <laughs> lava lair. <laughs> I think I think that's what uh, Pirate Kyra's mansion in Raiden Blue Devil was missing. It just it was it was missing. Um, it was it was just missing more of like lava. It needed more lava. Wait a minute. Oh. Oh shit. Wait. Wait a Wait. I thought I was gonna ruin myself. Okay. Okay, yeah, there we go. Okay, good. That's good. That's, that's actually really good. Okay, that makes me happy. Woo! Okay, sorry.
or actually, does it? How do I push myself a block further? Oh, wait a minute. No, 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 I don't this go. Sorry, sorry, this boss was required to use my brain cells. I, I think I think uh, Frogger Two is probably the fro the the uh, Dark Souls and Frogger franchise because I think I think I remember Frogger Two being a lot harder than this. Uh, I might have to play Frogger Two again. Maybe I'll stream Frogger Two after this, but I don't know. Wait. Fuck. Wait, what? I'm restarting this. No, I'm actually restarting this. What the hell was that? Chemical, I have to go now. I love you, and I'll see you later. <laughs> see, I want, he seriously wants to uh, take you down the port. <laughs> I, there is no Wani port. I, I, I have to preface this every single time. There is no Wani port. There is no Wani port. Actually, wait, no. I think, I think someone made, like, um, on the Google image results of Dr. Wani, there is, I think, like, inflation uh, in diaper porn of Wani. I don't know if that counts as porn. It's, like, fetish stuff, so... There is fetish porn of Wani, but there's no, like, standard, like, cock and balls out Wani picks. Which is... Okay, it's it's uh, it's fortunate or unfortunate, depending on who you are, but I, th I personally find that to be a pretty fortunate scenario. Holy shit, the final level's out. This isn't the final level. I think there's like four levels. I think there's like three levels after this. No, two levels. And then there's like the... Um, there's two levels after this, and then the final boss. Or maybe there's an entire world after this. Maybe maybe this game just goes on forever, and I'm just going to be stuck here for all of eternity. Maybe maybe like th maybe this, this stage is symbolic. Maybe I'm actually in hell right now. Why do you know this? I'll tell you why I know this right now. I'll tell you, okay, you wanna know? You wanna know why I know this? Because when I was drawing this image, I wanted to draw Dr. Wani, right? So if I'm drawing Dr. Wani, I wanna look at reference material of Dr. Wani. So I went to Google and I searched up Frogger, Dr. Wani, and then I went to Google Images and it just, it was just there, okay? I, I, I didn't have a choice in the matter. I, I didn't, I didn't choose for that, okay? It was there. It was there, and I did not have any any say in the matter. I was just shown the Wani picks, okay? That is why I know this. Sorry. I don't. I can't remember if I had saved search on, to be honest. <laughs> why would I need save search when, like, looking at Dr. Wani, though? Like, that just doesn't make any sense. It wouldn't make any sense if it weren't for the fact that people, like, were sick enough to draw that. <laughs> Although, um, Frogger, uh, series has more- Okay, so, after one of my streams, right, um, one of my friends, uh, sends me, uh, a screenshot of, uh, Rule 34, right? Not, not like, not like actual like porn, right? But like, but like the website, and then they, they it was like the, it was like the search results for um, Frogger, right? And <laughs> there were there was Frogger series, and then there was Frogger character, and Frogger series had like slightly more results. So uh, do with that information what you will. I don't know. Why I don't have it all. Actually, no. I know I didn't have it on my default because um, I draw on the iPad, but like the iPad is connected to my dad's account, right? So um, I, I don't, I don't think he has Save Search on, which um, you know leave that to interpretation. Uh, so, <laughs> and also it's like, and also it's in private browsing mode, which I, actually, what is what is private browsing mode default to in terms of like searching? Because I, I I keep it on private because I don't want I don't want um, I don't want Frogger characters to be in my dad's search history, you know. I don't want to do that to him. No, but I, I think I think I have um, save search on on my on my laptop because uh, if you search up VTuber male, uh, you get you just immediately get porn. I learned that the hard way. Oh 
right. Actually, I didn't get hit a single time. Are you guys proud of me? I'm pretty proud of me right now. I'm so proud of myself for like making that accomplishment. Yippee! Yay! Yeah, yay! Yeah, I um, I can't, I can't, I can't do an enthusiastic yippee. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm a dude depleted, and I don't even need this health item. Fuck you, game. <laughs> take, take that, take that, bro. But I don't really get why they give health items in the first place, even because like, why, why would I want a health item if like getting hit once before I have to restart the stage? And I just like restart the stage. It's gonna reset me either way, so I don't I don't really understand how it matters at all. Fuck, how did I do this puzzle again? Oh wait. I'm sorry. I'm <sighs> Okay, how do I how do I give myself energy again? I'm sorry, like, this game just makes me feel so dead inside. Okay. <laughs> you know, I'm just making myself a quick mental break, actually. One sec. Allow, allow, allow me. Allow, allow me. You wanna play something else? I still have the willpower. The willpower never leaves me. Okay, I might actually play some mini games though, just like get get my get my mind off things, you know. Tears of Spirits, level one. Okay. Look at all these bright colors. Look at all these like happy, cheerful animals. Man, this game is so fun. I'm enjoying this. <sighs> this is good. This is actually really good. I like this. This makes me happy right now. That was... As fun, but hey, who cares, right? Like this is, this is perfectly fine. I'm actually enjoying this right now. I'm enjoying this. I am enjoying my playthrough of Brugger and Ancient Shadow. What the fuck was that? That was so lame. <laughs> okay, fine, fine, fine. Have your own game. No bonus. Actually, you know what? I want to. I want to check if any of my if any of my good frog friends have any letters for me. You know what? I I think I think that's pretty good. I would love to overwrite the save file. This is what Frogger does to a motherfucker, by the way. I just hope you know that. All right, please, someone have some letters for me. I'm so desperate. I'm so desperate for like any any form of contact. Oh my god. Yes. The big one, Lumpy, my man. How, how's it going? That's going amazing. I'm at Angler Swamp now, and I finally caught one. It's not the bigger one, but it's gonna make some fine eating. Sorry, you're gonna miss my fish fricassee, buddy. Your pal, Lumpy. God, I love you, Lumpy. Dude, Lumpy's amazing. Respect to my main man, Lumpy. Okay, Lily. You're going? I am going. Before you go, can we hang out for a bit? Fuck that. Oh shit, we get the choice. Okay, fuck, now I'm kind of curious. Okay, guys, do we hang out with Lily? Or or sh or should we or should like Lily get fucked over? <laughs> she messaged you to tell you that you weren't going to have fish. <laughs> that is kind of a dick move, especially when we're trying to save the world. But like, I, I, I kind of, I kind of get it. You know, like we can only last for so long, bro.
All right, let's see here. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not getting any messages about either, so I'm just gonna say no. Fuck you, Lily. I'm gonna kill myself, Lily. <laughs> no, no, that's bad. Frogger, the books I've been studying show that it may be very difficult to reseal the temple. Okay, cool. If we can manage to reseal it, though, my research on this matter will be complete. That is amazing. Continue research, Grand Frog. Girlfriend Frog is cringe. <laughs> yeah. No hanging out. What do you mean new hat? I got this hat at the start of the stream. Actually, no, the hat is new, I guess. Let me play one of the mini games, though. I, I'm, I am curious, though. Like, why is the volcano named Sealed Heart? That sounds like a Pokemon fan game. But, like, I'm not complaining. That's a badass name. I'm just wondering, like, what it has to do with anything. Does it have to do with any, like, the hard side to throw off? Okay, we're gonna play as my main, like, my main man, Lumpy. Yeah. Dodgeball? Oh. Oh, this is new. I like this. Heart of the Mountain? Oh, yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Oh my god, and we got the, the naked crocodiles. Okay. Okay, avoid the balls, alright. Oh wait, what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh my god. <laughs> Fuck, I thought I discovered a cheat. Oh my god. Wait, what the fuck was that? What? I thought I was supposed to go in a specific direction, man. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, so the green ones go in the opposite direction. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it now, I get it now. Wait, no, they don't, no, they don't. What the fuck? Then why did it randomly go in the... Winner! What? I don't know, I thought the minion was pretty fun. I mean, look at that, everyone else is drowning to death while Lumpy celebrates. That is actually so horrific, though. What? Green ones change direction, yeah, I guess so. They just change direction like a complete random, that's cool. Okay, I'm gonna play Frogger. In Frogger. Frogger assessed. Alright, I love Frogger. I mean, oh man, I love Frogger. I love Frogger. Man, I love Frogger. Frogger. Yeah. Man, Frogger is such a great franchise. Okay, I collected Frogger. Oh man, I even got the firefly. That's great. I sure love it when Lumpy Force fireflies. That's my favorite part of Frogger. Oh fuck, oh fuck, wait no. There we go. Okay, good. That, that's, that's actually pretty good. Okay. Oh wait. Oh, okay. No time bonus. Oh right, right. There's a time bonus. I forgot about that. Okay. Frogger, get over here. I want to collect you. Jeez. <laughs> Only with Lumpy, bro. Only with Lumpy. Guys, this is so retro, by the way. Okay, okay, this is this is looking pretty good. This is looking pretty 
pretty splendid right now. Straight up on G for for real FR. I haven't checked if if Lumpy has any results though. Uh, um, I will have to I'll have to look into that. <laughs> I don't think he would, because I don't I don't think anyone would draw um, Lumpy. Unless he gets like Wario status from Bullet Cube, ironically. This is what the kids call retro. All right, I got myself a frog right there. And that there, oh fuck, oh my god, I missed the fly. That, 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 that there is a frog. Okay, 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 I'm doing this, I'm doing this. Why are the turtles so fast, bro? Dude! Okay, okay, I'm pretty proud of this. We're making progress, guys. We're making... Okay. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Strats. Strats. Genuine. Genuine strats. What the fuck? What was that, man? What was that? Dude, are you kidding me? Okay, okay, okay. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, wait a minute. Right here. Wait a minute. Right here. Right here. Right now. Okay, I missed that. 34, that's my favorite number. Just kidding, my favorite number is 9. 9 is such a good number, bro. Frogger, get over here. Get over here, Frogger. I, uh, something I don't get about, like, um, about, like, Frogger and Pac-Man is that, like, the bonus items, you know, in Pac-Man sends, like, fruit, and then in, um, in, like, uh, f oh my god, wait, in, in Frogger sense, like, flies, right? They spawn for such, like, a low amount of time that you wouldn't even have any time to, like, actually react and get them. Like, I like how Dig Dug does it, where, like, um, you have to meet a certain quota in the game in order for it to show up. And, like, it still shows up for, like, a decent amount of time. Which is just like, yeah. That's how it... Oh, it's out of time. Okay. That makes sense. If I'm just fine, five. Nine. I I think I think five is kind of mid, to be honest. It's literally mid. It's literally like down the middle of ten, dude. Okay, we got snakes now. Okay, I don't know. I don't know like how long I can play Frogger to make it entertaining. But I just, I just wanna, I just wanna get, you know, like a, a high score in Frogger right now. Like I just, I just, I just wanna play. Okay, what well, you have to understand, when I played Frogger in, um, oh god, where was it? In Victoria, like I sucked at it. I was so bad at Frogger, and I was like, dude, I wanna not be bad at Frogger. I wanna like actually like succeed in playing Frogger, but I just did not get that far. It was like, it was so embarrassing. I felt so ashamed of myself for not, like, not being good at Frogger. If I have kids, I'm gonna beat them for not being good at Frogger. <laughs> no, 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 no! Okay, fine. Wait, what? Okay.
There we go. Okay. All right. Okay. Is it is it is it a nine? It's just like a quirky ten. Okay, how the fuck do I exit this? By the way, wait, 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 wait. Let me, <laughs> let me leave, please. Yes, I would like to save my ranking. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Quick mental break aside, okay. Um, should I, should I, should I like, should I keep practicing the stage or should I do something goofy? Sans go about 50%. Yeah, exactly. Up to, up to, oh my god, I hate it when people say up to you. Oh, I don't know what's your decision. Dude, I'm asking for a reason. <laughs> Just say I have no input, dude. Practice the stage. Okay, thank you. Thank you for that. God, I need to like remember how to be like entertaining. I need to like. I need... <laughs> I'm sorry, cause like, cause like, okay, okay. The thing is, the thing is, right? Like for for doing these live streams, like it's always like just peak maximum energy for like the first like half an hour, and I just like, and then I remember what game I'm playing, and then I just lose all my energy, and I just become completely dead inside. It's absolutely crazy. Fuck. You have got to be getting me, man. And then we get onto the hard part, yeah. Because, like, you see, like, there's there's three stages that, like, aren't rendered there. So, I, I like, <laughs> this isn't the end. It's not the end. There's more after this, and I'm so sad. So, I'm, like, in so much pain right now. But I'm not wearing my crown. Yeah, they always remove your hats after, like, you, you exit the game, which is so weird. Like, why would they not save the hats? Major bag bomb glitch. Whoops. Oh my god. <laughs> Nitro Zeus message retracted. Damn, okay. Retract that message. You said nothing. Ugh. Actually, I'm curious because like YouTube Studio shows a graph of like all the all the messages that are sent, and then it's like if if a bunch of people started retracting their messages, would that count as like negative messages in, at that part of the stream? Wait, no, 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 no. Okay, there we go. I was so sad. I was so scared. What do you? Th I don't know what you said, bro. All I know is that you retracted the message. You were probably just telling me to cope, to be honest. How many are in a usual stream? You mean like chat messages? I don't know. I don't really pay that much attention to it. Like, I, I pay attention to the viewership levels. I don't really pay attention to the amount of messages I get, you know? I mean, obviously, like, messages are good because it means, oh my god, it means I'm, I'm talking. But also, it's a sign that, like, viewers are engaged and, like, you don't want to, like, say random bullshit. Uh, and that's that's a good thing. That's that's always a good thing. People are like in chat and being like, "Hey, I'm Shang Word." I mean, obviously, no one's required to like say messages. Yes, you are. You are required to speak right now. Let your presence be known. Nah. Um. But yeah, I mean, that's that's always how streaming is, isn't it? Okay. And then we get over here. All right. For the state of Canada. Oh, okay, yeah. There's a lot of jokes you can make in the state of Canada. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. No, no. We're, we're, yeah. I mean, the entire world's fucked right now, but yeah, Canada, Canada's always fucked. But like in relation to this stage, yeah. 
I think I think this is just Frogger goes to Canadian Forest. Honestly, I think that's what the stage is. Thank you, Frogger. Thank you, Frogger, for jumping there. And then look at funny website about 34 rules and search of funny images of Frogger characters. I, I can, like, search how many results each of the characters have. Um, I know that Wani is at zero, and I know that Frogger is at least, like, I don't know, like, 10, like, 20, maybe. Um... Uh, yeah, that's it's it's not that which is a good thing, which is a good thing. What I what I'm wondering though, is it is it of this design or is it of the Apple Arcade design? Or is it of like the arcade arcade design? Apple Arcade has some like good games. I just I'm just not interested in like getting Apple Arcade. Because like I don't I, I don't wanna get like a Mac or anything. And I'm not gaming for my phone, because fuck that. I, w I wish Xbox Game Pass took the Apple Arcade approach of like getting like actual exclusive games, because <laughs> they're like, oh yeah, we wanna we wanna get um we wanna get a cut of that Apple money. And it's like, okay, Apple money. Um, they're getting that through the the banger exclusives in, in like several franchises. You got like an exclusive Sonic game. You get um you know like a Hello Kitty game. Um, I don't know what I think like, they had like a Lego fighting game. I, I don't know what other Apple Arcade exclusives there are. Well, oh, actually, no, Frog, of course. But, like, yeah, that seems like some good shit. Oh, actually, we know. I think they made, like, an Angry Bird HD remake, so, like, that's, that's like, fucking cool, bro. Oh, wait, I'm not supposed to do that, am I? Oh, wait, no, I am. Never mind. Or the Karina. <laughs> who would, who would draw not unsavory content? Of the great quest design. What's what masochistic motherfucker would do that? No, I'm genuinely asking. What? Dude, no, no, bruh. Just no, man. Fuck, what did I do last time? I'm trying to think of what I did last. What, what did I do last time? Oh wait, no, no, no! Now I know what I did last time. Let's see. I've got a game suggestion for you. Um, or, um, wait, what? On Xbox 360. Oh wow! Like I, I, what, 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 what game though? I'm, I'm very confused. I would if I got paid bucks for it. The biggest pet peeve of mine is people call money bucks. I just don't like the sound of it. <laughs> except, except for that one meme where it's like, "Wow, I just saved myself 150 bucks." Sheesh! Like that. That's my favorite thing out there. That wasn't the end of the stage. I knew it wasn't. I wasn't gonna trick myself. I ain't no chump. I ain't no chump who gets tricked by Frogger. Woo! That could have been bad. That could have been really bad. <laughs> Oof. Oh, oh, that's so nice. That's so nice of them. What the? What is that? <laughs> no! 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 No, they are not. They are not. There is no way. There is no way. Oh, dude, are you serious? <laughs> well, I'm going to be here for a while. Or alt 
ultimate Tenkai Tenkaichi. Tenkaichi. There. Yeah. Uh, I I would love to play Dragon Ball for a Connect though. Oh my god. I swear to god. Okay, last time. Last try, last try. Dude, what is that? What is that, man? What is that? <laughs> Dude, you cannot expect me. You cannot expect <laughs> Who do you who do you think designed this level? Who do you think designed this level in particular? So like what do you think happened to the playtesters? Like what do you what do you think happened to the playtesters of this game? Did they just did they just like shoot themselves? Like what happened? Why am I still fighting? I'm in here, bro. Tayo <laughs> Kojima. Uh. We're out of time, yeah. They were on a they were on a strict frog set. Cause like how many fucking frogger games do they pop out during this time? Cause like okay, okay, okay. Yeah, Frogger the Great Quest probably released in like, I don't know, like 2000, 2001, right? And like that feels very Shrek inspired. Actually, wait, no, when, when did Frogger the Great Quest come out? Cause it didn't release on Xbox, right? Frogger the Great Quest. Release day. November 19th, 2001. Okay, I don't know when Shrek came out. I thought Shrek came out in 2001 as well, so I, I that kind of messes my theory of this being Shrek inspired. Actually, when did Shrek come out? Wait, one sec. Shrek release date. Oh! Oh, so it's not Shrek inspired. Because, like, that's only like a couple of months before this came out. Okay, never mind. That's weird. So, between this and, like, okay, so that's, like, a hit, really, so many games, holy shit. Practice is, like, a throwing controller, yeah, exactly. Okay, 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 please, please, dude. Please, oh my god. Oh, just, 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 just like, bro. Bro, bro. Bro! Okay. What is the worst character assassination you've ever seen? That is a really good question. Oof. Oof. Okay, okay, okay. I'm trying to think of, like, any media I'm into. Uh, the only the only example I can think of is uh, is like the, the Spider Verse sequel, where um, they where like Miles is the only one who's like, yeah, all of this is bad, but like every single Spider Man out there is like always like, yeah, we're not we're not gonna let like one person die. Uh, we're gonna you know we're, we're gonna like save as many people as possible, and it does not matter if we're like risking the multiverse. We need to get one person saved. Like it is just incredibly out of character for like the entire foundation of like Peter Parker. That they wouldn't do that. So, like the Spider Verse, it's a, it's a it's an amazing film, but it, it like it just messes that up so much. Care from Drill Drama? I haven't watched that much Drill Drama. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um... Oh boy. What is some bad character assassination? I think I think Sparks. Uh... Uh, it's not really character assassination, but they did my boy so dirty in that game. <laughs> in the Legend of Spyro at the beginning. Dude, they could have written him so much better. I 
I, I think, um, I, I think, like, just, like, story assassination and just, like, um, just, like, a lack of care for consistency or anything, just because Gondor's imaginators like that, just, that can piss me off so much. I need to consume more media that like fucks itself over. <laughs> well, actually, I think I think the Sonic franchise kind of fucks itself over every like two seconds, right? Like, I feel like I feel like the game has the series has just been like so inconsistent now that like every like no one can agree on what's good with the series anymore, which is a bit concerning. Whoa. Okay. All right, do this puzzle again. Wahoo! Goku in Dragon Ball Super. Um, actually, uh, apparently, something I heard in Dragon Ball. Apparently, like they have several um, arcs in Dragon Ball that try to like create like the early stuff in Dragon Ball because it's like a completely different series by that point. And then they're just like, oh yeah, here's like. Here's like it's just like an alternate version of Goku's arc, which is basically like the exact same thing. I don't get that. But then again, I've never watched the show, so who knows? Oh wait, yeah. As well. Oh wait, no, no. <laughs> I almost made a massive mistake there. Oof. Oh boy. Wait, did I? Yeah, I did. Oh yeah, there we go. Okay. That's the good stuff. <laughs> I can rant about it for hours. I would I would love I would love a video essay just talking about it, like how much Dragon Ball constantly fucks itself over. That's my favorite thing in any franchise. Like I don't know I've never watched a single episode of Miraculous Ladybug. I just have like a best friend who like just used to love it, but now hates it for the same reason a lot of people do. Because apparently like <laughs> <laughs> the like there are so many things where like the writer just like or like the lead guy behind the story is just like eh fuck it and then it's just like dude like I cannot fathom how like awful the the main writer of that series is sometimes like it is it is, it is really funny like straight up just saying like oh yeah this character isn't meant to go through like any character development she's just like inherently mean and like okay I have characters like that you know the wooded devil is an example but like it's She's a machine. <laughs> like those are those are fucking humans in there. Okay, so oh, that's too early. Okay, well too late. Too late. That was close. That was really close. Oh yes. Okay. What the fuck? What? Uh, Sir? Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, this isn't funny. This isn't funny. This is this is not funny. Oof. What crack were they smoking? Don't fucking sleep on me, Frogger. Okay, we're getting close, we're getting close, we're getting close. Yes! Yes! 
Yes! Okay. Heard the lead writer is racist would not surprise me. I mean, they're French, right? Or actually, are they French? Or is it just like France as the setting? Because like, people like France. Uh, I think I've read, I've only read a little bit of Harry Potter, personally. <sighs> okay. Like, okay, okay. From input delay, like, by like, by like, small milliseconds, which in this is important, to your brain processing the information in front of you and hitting the button, dude, you need to hit like beforehand. No, no, I'm not. I'm not doing that. That's not. I'm not doing that. That's not. Ooh, boy. Okay. Ugh. Kind of like the music, though. That's it's pretty. It's pretty. Pretty funky. I wish they ported this to 3DS. Actually, this would be a pretty good game on 3DS. Like, I'm just looking at this right now, and like, I, I would like playing this on 3DS. It looks like a 3DS game, to be honest. I mean, that's a compliment. This game looks amazing. For a 3DS game. As someone who, like, grew up playing 3DS games. I like the 3DS. The 3DS is, like, one of my favorite consoles. Because it's a 3DS. It has, like, Street Pass and stuff. Dude, imagine, like, Frogger Bowl with Street Pass. Fuck, I missed it again. Yeah, exactly. Um, some of them have like slightly like longer times to like actually get on with it. Uh, yeah, that is that is a good point. That is a good point. Uh, my friends really want me to play, want me to buy uh, Frogger Helmet Chaos because it has download play. If you don't know what download play is, it's basically this feature, right, where um, if you own one copy of the game, then you can get someone to um, get open their DS or 3DS, and they can download. Um, certain parts of the game so that they can, you can access the multiplayer of the game without actually having multiple copies of it. So you can use like one copy and that play like four player multiplayer. It's pretty sweet. Um, yeah, so this game supports um, Frogger Helmet Chaos supports uh, download play. So um, if I if I got a copy of it, then I could like play with all my friends. And that, that actually seems pretty sick. I think there is one Frogger game on 3DS, but apparently it's like really rare. Oh my god! This is huge! This is huge, bro! No, 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 no. What the fuck was that? Oh my god! What the fuck was that? What? I'm sorry, so the platform they send you in afterwards is a platform with a bunch of enemies that you don't know the pattern of. I'm speechless. That is just awful game design. Progress, everybody! Frog. Okay, I'm gonna try this one more time, and then I'm gonna like, and then I'm gonna skin myself afterwards. I don't know. I'm gonna skin someone. I'm gonna skin someone after the stream.
Absolutely. You, 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 I feel like, I feel like you can't, like, I, re I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm experiencing someone's generational trauma when I'm, like, playing this level. Like, I, I feel like, I feel like the person who designed this level was, like, locked in the basement, and, like, the only times they would come up, they would have to, like, physically fight to get fed. And then, like, um, and then, like, afterwards, like, some kind of, like, older, like, individual maybe their parents maybe i think they were like kidnapped at a very young age and then like some older individual would just like come in out of nowhere and start beating on them mercilessly um and that sounds graphic but like i feel like that's the only way um you can have a childhood that like leads to you um in the future when you become an adult making game design like this like i i don't think like someone had to have been like raising a sociopath in order to actually like make a game like this for children like okay, okay. Norm normally it's like hee hee cope. Well, you you guys gotta agree with me here. You guys gotta agree with me here. But, like that is that is just like what the fuck is that game design? No. There is no hope. I'm 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 like I'm actually fuming right now. What the fuck is any of this? <laughs> yeah like slowing down those platforms and like um not making the lava send you all the way back to the last uh checkpoint i feel like that would have like gone a really long way in making me not want to rip someone's esophagus out i i think that would have been really nice of them if they could have just like not just not, bro. And then we have a berry section over here. Oh my god. Fuck berry. I'm, I'm, I'm back to hitting berry again. I used to be happy earlier. Like, I was so happy after beating the last boss. Or, like, beating that one level. That, um, that I was like, you know what? Never mind. I like berry now. I don't like berry anymore. Fuck berry. I hate berry. I hope berry gets skinned alive at some point. No irony. I mean, I okay. I, I was close to crying earlier in this in this stream. I'm not even joking. I was actually about to cry. Like when when I when I like discovered that like the lava hits like send you back to the last checkpoint. Like I was I was genuinely on the verge of tears. This game has put me on the verge of tears at multiple points. I don't think a video game has ever made me almost cry before. <laughs> this actually needs to become the next, like, Geometry Dash. Okay, I'm at max health. So, please. No. Cool. Sorry, I panicked. Not the emotional story, no, never. Actually, I cried while playing Titanfall 2's campaign. That was pretty sad. And then they, and then they kind of like fucked that it later on. I'm not gonna spoil like what they what they do, but like they they set up a plot event that's like really emotional, and they completely ruin it later. And they ruin it again. They make it just even worse later. Titanfall 2, yes! I feel like that's like, I, I like I played that and I was like, damn, if more shooters were like this, I'd be more of a fan of the genre, you know? Because I don't really like the online aspect of shooters. I like the social aspect of shooters, but like, not really like, you know, does that make sense? I hope it makes sense. Because if it doesn't get fucked. So I'm projecting my anger on you guys right now. I apologize. Yeah. 
I don't really play. Well, okay. <laughs> I grew up playing Skylanders, right? So of course I love couch co-op, and I played like some of the Lego games. So yeah, I'm a pretty big fan of couch co-op. Um, and I love like um, you know I mentioned download play earlier. I love like Mario Party DS. I used to play that all the time. I love like the the Star Rush mode in Mario uh, in Musical Mario Bros. DS. Um, you know I love I love like I I okay. I I I I I don't own the Wii, but like um, I was I was actually like when I went to uh, a friend's house and we were all like playing D and D, right? We started playing like Mario and Sonic at the uh, at the Olympic Games, the uh, the Vancouver 2010 version and the uh, fuck the London version, and like that those are really fun games. Those are like actually really fun games uh, to play, and I, I like I, I like I like party games. Um, I like social games. I'd say. Those are probably my favorite. We also played Eggmania. That was pretty cool. But it was the game version. I realized um, the game version is worse than the Xbox version. Um, the Xbox version has like much faster load times, but it's also like a better controller for the game. I'm gonna rip someone's nuts off now, by the way. <laughs> uh. Couch Cup is goaded, yeah. I need to, I need to like drag someone in my house and play. Actually, there's, there's a, there's a Happy Feet 2 video game achievement where if you play the entire game in co-op in one sitting, then you get an achievement for that. And I kind of want to get it. Bro. I kind of want to get it. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Like I feel like I feel like um I w I wouldn't be able to like invite people over and be like hey do you want to like just like um play the games I have actually I've played like Sonic and Sega Ultimate Racing with a couple of people before um and we had a great time we played Skylanders with people before they they had an amazing time there too and they were like non Skylanders fans um so yeah I just um so th those were pretty good times I'd say. And also like Crash um, of the Titans, that has very laggy and like buggy multiplayer, but it's pretty fun. So yeah, I'd say Couch Cop is probably my favorite genre. Um, and also like the Jackbox Party Pack games, like those are those are like just immaculate. Um, especially if you're playing them like in person. Um, online is fun too, but like in, uh, you know like in person is just so great. Best kid show I've seen. That's a good question, actually, because I'm not. I, I realized recently that I'm not actually a fan of kid shows. I I like the aesthetics and I like the character designs, but I don't actually like the contents or the writing. And it's a it was a weird thing for me to realize, because uh, I, I I like I, I take a lot of inspiration from kids media. Um, I'd say. <laughs> I can't remember if Ninjago was actually good, but when I was six years old, that was the shit. So I'm gonna say Ninjago is the best kid show, and the worst is one that I watched recently, which is um, Glitter Force. I am not the demographic; it's for like young girls. I get it, um, but God, the show was not good. Um, but I'm not gonna say it's a bad show because it is a localization of an anime. <laughs> oh my God! Sorry. Screw me so much, my throat, my throat is in so much pain right now. Um, because apparently, um, okay, so it is a localization of the anime, um, Smile Pretty Cure, right? And apparently, um, Smile Pretty Cure is better, it's just a garbage dub. Um, so, they actually, like, remove some pretty badass scenes from it, um, to make it, like, less suspenseful, to make kids not scared of everything. So I'm, I'm gonna go with, okay, yeah, that's, that's probably, probably... Um, uh, like a better thing when I actually like watch it in its like intended form instead of just like some garbage localization. So I can't really be too harsh on it. Unlike un, <laughs> when I when I'm saying I watched it for research, I'm being genuine because I, I I was actually trying to like learn what the magical magic fuck the magical girl genre was. Jug was amazing, based my man based. Um, I can't remember if Shima was good, but that, like, I remember that had some pretty good arc in it. Um, and, okay. What other shows did I even watch growing up? Fuck. Oh my god, I'm trying to think of, like, shows I've watched. Of, like, kid shows I've watched. 
Fuck, I haven't watched enough kids media, actually. Um, actually, no, I've been watching a bit of Batman Beyond. I think Batman Beyond is an amazing show. I mean, I know, I know it's for, like, a bit of an older audience. Um, but, like, still, it's, it's, it's great. It's such a good show. Like, it's, a, it's like, it's like a, it's like a villain of the week show, but it, it makes each villain, like, feel like its own, like, amazing story. It's great. Jimmy Neutron's also pretty good. One second, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna replay the, um, the main mansion, forget. Because this is an easier stage, I wanna, I wanna take my mind off this. Although, I do think, I do think I'm getting better at the game, though, because I, I've noticed that, like, I'm starting to get through these stages a lot faster. Like, example, um, that one stage has been, like, three hours on in one stream, and then, like, in the next stream, I, I just beat it, for, like, first try. Which, like, is not bragging at all. I'm sure a lot of you guys could do better than me. Um, if you decided to play Frogger, don't. Don't play Frogger. Worst kid Joe I've seen is... Breadwinner! Dude, oh... My god. Dude, that was a repressed memory. Stop. Genuinely stop. No, I wanted to forget about that. Ugh. Dude. I can only remember a few scenes from that show. I think it's just a bunch of, like, colorful nonsense. Because I actually remember watching it a lot. Um, yeah, that show was interesting. What are some Canadian cartoons I've watched? Detention Air is actually pretty decent. It's not like it's not like amazing, um, but it's 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 all right, you know. It's not like a crazy show or anything. It has a good premise. Um, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> it has a cool art style, actually. I like the art style. That's it, though. There aren't that many things I like about the show because it's just kind of like a lot a lot of gro a lot of like t typical like Canadian gross out humor that is like absolutely someone's fetish and I'm never a fan of that stuff. Hi Guardian Spice, yeah. I, I feel like that's like that's like one of those shows that like people watch like I oh I feel like that's one of the shows people watch like ironically um I, for like a bit right and then they just realize like oh this this isn't this isn't funny garbage this is just like actually ass that's how I felt like playing um like Burger King the video game like it was just like it was like it's gonna be so funny guys no it wasn't funny it was just terrible it was just a terrible game legit whenever i he like i i remember like i heard a i heard a song from like a really obscure video game uh pray the stars uh pray spelled with a e because like you're eating the stars get it um and then basically one of the songs kind of reminded me of the title theme and i'm i'm i'm, I'm not i'm not joking for a second here like my heartbeat started going up like that like like i feel like for, i'm not even joking i i'm pretty sure burger king the video game legitimately traumatized me Have you, I'm I'm not I'm not fucking I'm not fucking with the king again. I'm not fucking with the king, bro. <laughs> um yeah, but um what else is there? Um in terms of like media. I mean like people people like watching videos about like weird, like bad things from like various um, eras so like I feel like if you if you made a video about high garden spice like it, it will probably get decent views I, I I'd recommend just the tried and true look at other thumbnails people have done and then just be like okay yeah just put like some of the characters in it and then just you know like draw draw your like Sona suffering I don't know that generally works pretty well Oh wait, <laughs> whoops. Okay, there we go. 
Oh. Yeah, I don't care because there's a full health of source in. So I don't mind any of this. You're kind of like required to speedrun here because like otherwise you're just gonna like immediately get hit by the ballerinas. Like one third of the video complained about uh, two characters on the list. <laughs> God, yeah. I'm just wondering, like, how do you fumble the bag that badly? And like, same with like um, the garbage Canadian cartoons from like, um, like you know the. I sort of fucking got it. Uh, same with like the, the old like Canadian cartoons that are like known for being like just completely terrible. Like, like how do you how do you get the opportunity to make a cartoon? And you can like write anything for it, and you, you like okay, you don't have like a high budget or anything. But you have like a decent animation budget. Like, how do you, how do you like look at that and go, okay, yeah, yeah, like that's we, <laughs> we 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 uh we're just gonna make something like completely ass, just to, like entertain kids for a while. Like no, because like people are like, oh yeah, it's meant to be like airing when like people aren't watching TV. No, I remember watching, like, I remember being on Teletoon, like, after school, and then, like, Teletoon being, like, Cartoon Network, but for Canadians. Um, and then just, like, being like, oh, man, this sucks. And that was it. Like, it was, like, was that, like, it was, you know, like, after school time, sometimes even on the weekends, you know, they, that you would be playing. And it's like, bro, what the fuck? I remember YTV aired, uh, like, more consistently good shows. YTV being just like I don't know they they are like Nickelodeon does I I feel like I feel like the the comparison of them being just like Canadian Nickelodeon or whatever doesn't really apply that much because they air like Cartoon Network and Nickelodeon media respectively but I feel like I feel like it's a bit of an apples to oranges comparison you know millennial writers and feminist writers I don't think there were any feminists working on Rocket Monkeys. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, or do you, or do you mean do you mean High Guardian Spice? If so, that makes a lot of sense. But I don't I don't think any feminists worked on Rocket Monkeys or Detention Air. Well, actually, no, Detention Air is good. Never mind. Yeah, like for animation issues, I can understand. Like, um, I can understand that. Like, you know, like lower budget. Um, or just like bad management, but like the, from the writing, how do you fuck up the writing? I mean, like I, I'm not, I'm not saying like I'm immune to that, but like, dude, okay, like okay, there, there's a lot of things that I fucked up in Reign of the Wood Devil, especially early on, but like, I, I, I fucking like I did the, I did the outline for that when I was 16, you know, and like. I don't know, people read the story until the end. A good chunk of people. So I, I feel like that's a that's a sign of like I, I don't I don't wanna like pat myself on the back too much, but like, you know, at least some level of quality, right? So I don't I like as a writer, I don't understand how someone can like have the opportunity and like make something that isn't good. Unless you just like genuinely have no inspiration. You know, like example like if someone like forced like Kaliana to be like turned into a it's like a 20 minute series of episodes like yeah I, I could I could get like that kind of mentality where it's just like looking the premise but then like terrible terrible execution Hi Guardian Spice um their trailers for the show bragged that the writing was for people like you no man for diversity well, I, I don't think there's anything wrong with a series not being for men. Um, if a series is, like, made for a certain demographic, then, like, that's cool. Um, you're, you're just, like, closing off a possible audience. Um, and, you know, if you... <laughs> I mean, I feel like making your uh, content available for all audiences, like, that's good. But it's just, like, if you want it for a specific audience, sure. Just, just know that you're, like, closing off a bit bad people. And I mean, if people, if people can like, but I feel like people, you kind of use that as a crutch, right? 
Because you can just, you can just use that as like an oh yeah the show isn't made for you why are you complaining about it when it's like you know for a lot of critics that's their entire job. So experience and falling faster and uh, things realize. Um, yeah, I guess so. Could be like deadlines too, right? Like if if you, if you if someone just tells me like oh yeah I come up with an idea then it's like okay. I can come up with an idea, but I, it won't be like awfully fleshed out for a while. Like you know, I I had an idea of like an entire book <laughs> earlier, but it's not it's not like anything crazy, right? It's just like the the sort of like vague premise of a book. Um, and then it's just like I don't I don't have any like characters or like chapters laid out. So someone like like okay, yeah, uh, I need everything done in a couple of months for like the the concept, and it's like okay. I can't do that. So it could just be deadlines. I, I get that. Is that as a positive? Um, yeah, I feel like... I feel like that isn't a big selling point, right? Like, um, I feel like... If, if you... Okay. <laughs> Say, saying this as, like, the epitome of, like, uh, no adversity here, but um, I feel like just like creating something. It's like okay, if you want like oh yeah, we're not having anything, we're not having anything white, we're not having anything cis, we're not having anything uh, straight, we're not having anything male. Okay, cool. Um, you know, does that does that mean it's bad? No. Um, does that mean uh, does that mean that like I wouldn't personally be interested? No, because if you're making a fantasy story, then I feel like <laughs> I feel like if you're writing a fantasy story, then um, you know, like uh, real world like uh, species and races won't really matter that much, um, unless your story is about that. Then power to you. Um, yeah. Yeah, but that is, I feel like people who, like, want diversity and wouldn't want to hire someone like me, that is, that is kind of cool. And then their counter-argument would be like, okay, yeah, but, like, that happened a long time ago against us. And it's like, yeah, never, never, it was never a good thing in the first place. <laughs> yeah, I agree with that. I agree with that so much. You should, you should never have diversity as your selling point. Unless you want to make something that is like uh, that, it, you want to have as a message to your group of people. Um, from a corporate standpoint, if you want to hire people who are like of a specific thing, like example, like um, Spider Verse, right? Um, they for like Spider Man India, they wanted um, you know uh, the voice actor to try to help them make it more culturally specific. That's great. But if you're if you're like, oh yeah, uh, we pride ourselves in like um, having like specifically staff from this race, it's like okay, well that's um, you know, if, if you, if you're all about voices, of course, I think everyone's voice should be heard in terms of, like, artistic media. Um, I think it, it you know, because that's, that's when things get tricky. Because once you start focusing on that, it, it starts to kind of go against the point of equality, right? If you're, like, trying to go for a, uh, <laughs> this is, this is, this is way, this is way too, this is way too deep of a conversation for Frogger, I'm sorry. Why am I having this conversation in a Frogger stream? Yeah. To pick people as people. Um, I, I, I am, um, a, um, I am, I am someone who has done that myself, um, in terms of depicting characters who are, like, in direct opposition of the like leading protagonist as um, liars or, or idiots or kind of just like you know manipulators, but it's it, <laughs> they're all they're all like robots and um, and dragons and like um, scalies and like monsters, so it's not really applicable to any like real world traits. Um, but yeah, I do think that's that's generally like a bad thing to do in writing. Not even like. It doesn't even have anything to do with, like, the race of the characters or, like, what they are. If you're just depicting everyone who's against your characters in, like, political belief, even if it, regardless of if it represents real-life values or not, if you're, uh, depicting characters who, um, are in opposition of your character as, like, completely just broken people, then, yeah, that's pretty stupid. 
um, you know, like Reign of the Wooded Devil, um, I'm gonna use two characters as an example, um, Thorn and Hive, right? Both characters who I could say, um, in the beginning of the story, and for Hive all throughout the entire thing, um, is in opposition of Dowser, right? Um, this is specifically because, um, in Thorn's case, he, um, isn't really pleased with her demonstrations of her abilities, right? So he's like, okay, this person might get themselves killed. I don't want them to get themselves killed, so I want to stop them from being a part of this. Um, so yes, in the beginning of the story, Thorn seems very antagonistic, um, especially because he's very like cold um, towards everyone around him, and that includes Dowser. But uh, by the end of the story, it's like, okay, yeah, um, this guy does have good intentions. He's just like untrustworthy of everyone around him, and you begin to understand that as the story goes along. For High Vault, uh, you know, he's very military. He's um, He doesn't have any confidence in Dazzler Strength either, so his idea is just force her into incredibly risky situations. How goes the frogs? This is just descended into a conversation about, like, about media now. I am repeating this level. I just like repeating this level, to be honest. This is just a level that I, like, replay constantly. Um, I need to give myself a mental break from one of the early stages. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna end off the stream by showing you um, the bullshit I had to deal with earlier. Okay. After this. After after I after I do this. One sec. Oh yeah, uh, Frogger briefly turned black for a second. That was cool. Yeah, that's what you missed. And he did like any any like jumped on a bunch of platforms. And he's, he's friends with Ignuous down. He was so cool. Frogger traumatized bro. So now we're talking about storytelling and depicting characters. Yeah, exactly. Want to read through all of Brain of the Wood Devil, uh, but for some reason we're holding. I get that. I get that. I actually have the entire um, Game of Thrones book series. Um, with me right now, and um, the reason I have it is because my dad really wants me to read it, right? Um, and I've just like, I was at like 11 uh, p.m. And I, and I was like, they introduced so many characters early on, and I'm like, dude, I can't, I like, I'm five pages in, I, I'm too tired for this. So I pushed it off for a while, and then I just haven't been like reading it. So I get that. I, I get like not motivating, motivating yourself to uh, to write though. Um, yeah, but like, um. I, you know, read it if you want, um, the early chapters aren't so good in my opinion, but, like, I, I reread a few scenes, and, like, dude, some parts go hard in my opinion. Some parts are really fucking good, others are, like, lame, but others are, oh my god, dude. Some parts go really hard. Yeah, actually, you guys, I, I wanna talk about a book I've been, I, I wanted to read. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna show you Sealed Heart though. I'm gonna show you Fourth No or what the what bullshit I have to deal with. Okay, so this is one book that I um that I'm trying to read, Dragon's Wood, right? It is com it was completely up my alley. Um, I am a I'm a four I'm a quarter through the book, right? 100 pages. Um, and I'm not going to finish reading it. I'm not reading the entire thing. And it is probably one of the most disappointing pieces of literature I've ever read. Period. Um, and in the first 100 pages, it was amazing. But you know, not in the first 100 pages. In like the first like couple chapters, it was amazing. Dude, okay, so basically, um, this is a society where, um, uh, where you have like a bunch of people and, um, witch hunting. Well, yeah, yeah, this is like medieval times, witch hunting is a thing, and, uh, magic is real here. But, um, the people who are burned alive, because witches, um, aren't the ones who are able to use magic. The protagonist is uh, is a woman, and she can use magic. And uh, worst of all, she has traits that are considered witch-like, as in uh, she wants to be an artist, as in she likes exploring. Uh, you know, she, she likes that little bit of freedom. Uh, so in this society, that's not allowed. Um, and during one time, um, because due to the death of the, uh, of the king, um, they're getting a new king, right? Who's, like, formerly prince. And there's this new witch hunter introduced, and she's such a great villain. Um, and she is here to kill any of the witches. Um, oh god. 
Actually, wait. Let me let me show you this fourth tower. Okay. So if you get if you get hit by this one thing, you have to restart from the beginning. <laughs> I'm not joking. Yeah. But um. So she starts witch hunting some people, and then one person, um, just a cute like, it. Okay. So the main character's father says like, this person's a witch. I hate them, and it's just for like some very dumb reasons. And then they get burned alive. And then um, the main character gets accused of being a witch. So then, uh, and the reason given is because one guy goes, Oh yeah, I saw her in Dragon's Wood, uh, like, you know, fucking Satan. And uh, and that's that's enough of people to go, I bet this person's evil. And uh, now people want her burned alive. Um, and then, so she's tortured horrifically. And, um, and basically they're like, tell us, tell us, um, like if your friends were also there and then she does and now and now people want to burn her two best friends alive so now they're on the run from the witch hunters and it's like shit dude they they have no they have no home they have very little survival skills um they're completely fucked they're all like slowly starving to death and they're like they're like living day by day and you like you like each chapter unfolds and you're like okay this is the last chapter i'll read this is the last chapter i'll read and it just keeps getting better because he's getting in more and more fucked scenarios. But then, um, one day, by the way, this is a romance book, um, this, this guy shows up, right? I can't even remember his name. I don't care about his name. Um, he just, he just shows up, and then he, he just, like, um, he's like, okay, uh, you know, like, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, like, uh, just, just, like, bring you guys to my house, even though, like, it's, it's illegal for me to do that, because you guys are, like, on the run from the witch hunters. Um, so I shouldn't be doing this. He faces no repercussions for this whatsoever, by the way. Um, and then he, uh, there's, he has, like, no flaws. He's, he's just someone who, like, wants to protect everyone. And, um, he never gets into any arguments with the characters. Um, the characters never, like, have any disputes with him. The only time he ever, like, gets into anything with the characters that's, like, negative is when the, he finds out that the protagonist is the reason why her friends are on the run from the witch hunters so it's like it's it's just it's not a good book because it's we just have like this guy who's clearly the love interest but there's nothing interesting about him and he ruins what was interesting about the story because it was like okay these guys are like barely surviving oh and now we have someone who's just like completely stopping them from being in any harm whatsoever they're completely safe now because of this guy and there's nothing there's just nothing happening. They're just, like, staying in the house for several chapters. And it's like, I don't care. Fuck, I hate that book. That book fucking sucks, man. Okay, sorry. I had to go on, like, a long game about this. Let's see. Um, if I uh, st streamed a read-through of it, would you watch and answer some questions? Um, sure, why not? If you want to, like, live stream reading it, why not? I don't know who else would watch a live stream that but like yeah go ahead man yeah no sorry I just had to like I just had to rant about that for a while Okay, okay, wait, wait, now, okay, we're, we're almost at the part now, we're almost at the part. Okay, okay, okay. Fourth knower, you are not going to imagine the bullshit I'm about to, I'm about to, like, show you, okay? This is just, like, the craziest thing I've ever experienced in a platformer. Oh boy, okay, okay, good, 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 fuck, okay. Look at this! Look at this! Are you gonna make it though? What do you mean? What, what, like, what, what, do, you, what do you mean? I, thought, I said, like, you were the one who would be, like, streaming it. Oh, you mean, like, make it this far? Yes, I'm gonna make it this far, fuck you. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. If I if I make this jump, then I will show you like how it even gets worse. It somehow gets worse. Okay, I made that jump, but look at this, look at this. 
<laughs> My god. Never mind. I thought I was on to something. I was just barely off, dude. I was barely off. <laughs> yup. Yup, this is the platforming. Oh my god. Just gonna have to wait for these to align after like a, a long ass time and even then the timing is super precise. Yeah, like, I know what timing that's supposed to be doing, it's just like, what the fuck. That was such a smooth jump, by the way, actually. <laughs> and now I focus. I just I just kind of stare at this for a while. Yep, you just have to wait. I God, I love padding. God, I love padding. Oh, okay, come on. Have your way. Holy shit, okay. Dude, okay, fine, 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 fine. Whatever. I I do not care I do not I do not care Frogger I do not care what Frogger ain't shadow. Okay, I can't see the timing because the timing is, uh, s what the fuck? SDMB? I, I have no idea. Dude. By the way, I've not collected a single coin in this stage. They just stopped giving me coins. Fuck you, game. Wake your, wake your ass up, bro, man. Wake your ass up. What the fuck, dude? Please. I, like, I don't have any commentary here. I just, I just have Frogger. All I have is Frogger. All I have is Frogger and my, my ever-dwindling patience. Tighter than, I don't know, it's just tight. Bro, it's fucking tighter than Wani's ass, man. What the fuck? Okay. I'm sorry for that. I'm sorry for making that. That was, that was, that was, that wasn't, that wasn't very, that wasn't very, I was about to say very, wasn't very cash money. How, how dead is that thing, actually?
holy shit, please, 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 dude, just please, please, I, I have nothing to comment on. Dude. Yeah, this is such a good gameplay, by the way. Okay, that's it. <laughs> uh, man, this is gonna make for such a great stream next time. No, I'm not gonna re retry. Wait, by the way, by the way, uh, can you guys, um, real quick, um, there was a bit I was going to do earlier in the stream, but, um, <laughs> no one, no one prompted it to happen. Um, so... <laughs> Can can someone can someone type in chat? Uh oh, wait, 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 why are why are you doing a stream on April first where nothing strange happens? Can we can we like can, can, can someone just type that real quick? I had an entire bit planned, but like nothing like it never happened. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna get my frogger crown in the meantime. Oh I oh shit, I have a letter. Okay, wait, and let me just... Okay, okay, thank you! Thank you! Thank you! Wait, okay, yeah, okay, okay, good, 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 okay, okay, so... <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Oh shit, you're right, that is a good po that is a good point, chat member. Huh, that- why- why did I- why did I not do an April Fool's Day bit? I can't do- a live stream on April first, without having something funny to happen. Like that's what that's what every creator needs. Like I can't do that. I already skipped out of the last year. There's no there's nothing I can do to like remove the opportunity. What the fuck? Where the fuck am I? Hey everyone, welcome wait, wait, to another grog testing grog sesh. Today I'm going to be grogging this guy I found. I, Apparently I, his I, name I, is like I, I, the I, Raptor. I, Sounds pretty gnarly to me, guys. Apparently this fucking dude made an animation a while back where he turned into a fire guy. And I thought I could do something pretty fitting. That's right, we're bringing out the Takazo Mori. Dig dog. I had that entire bit, like, just completely set up. Just, like, complete. I had that, com I had that entire bit <laughs> prepared specifically <laughs> for that, for, for, like, if someone didn't want to ask that. But it never happened at any point in the stream. So I just, I was just like, fuck, I'm not, I'm not going to have the opportunity for that. Please tell me you'll share that later. My hopes was that, um, <laughs> my hope was that someone would, like, say that at the start of the stream, and then I'd, like, share that around a bit. Um, for context, um, that's actually, like, the general premise of that animation of, like, my after getting grogged was, um, <laughs> an unused bit from, uh, something else completely that I was like, okay, I need to, I need to reuse this. And I need to use it for something, so I want to use it for an April Fool's Day bit. <laughs> Thank you for not questioning things. Okay, that is... That's... Okay, I, I just want to read this letter, though. I will want to clip this and, like, send it to people, though. Oh, that's the big one. Okay, never mind. No new letter. Fuck. Actually, no, just in case there's a seed he gives me afterwards, I'm gonna... Uh, you know, I, I gotta, I gotta go after Bear, uh, Lumpy Seed. Lumpy, give me your seed, man. Oh, there was no seed in that. Okay, that's fine. All right. Okay, that is the live stream. Um, I'm probably gonna draw something in celebration of DeviantArt's um, April Fool's Day special because they did something really fun, and it involves baking. Um, but not like actual baking. 
and my username is baking but not actual baking so you know that's pretty crazy I thought of April Fools you're gonna do was say the waste about four hours without an April Fools prank was April Fools, yeah. Your eyes <laughs> bro, just yeah. I I just had to do like the the gnarly voice, bruh. Yeah, that was, so that was <laughs> that, that was what I ended up going with. So um I don't know, I might I might clip this and send it to people later. I'm very disappointed no one asked me um about like April Fools earlier <laughs> i i feel like that's only gonna be seen by like only only like whoever's in chat right now but, but yeah thank all of you for that <laughs> um if you're feeling sadistic today then um be sure to like the video and like um i don't know like clip me talking about ripping people's spines out and then like send, send it to people because um that tells youtube that people are engaged with this and uh it'll it'll send more unfortunate souls to my content so you know, that's pretty crazy. Yeah. Congrats, I'm gonna grow you. Hey, what? <laughs> the fuck, man? Yeah, so I'm gonna... I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do now. I'm just gonna... I I, I don't even have the energy to scream. Actually, wait, no. No, I know what to do. I know, I know what to do now. Okay, okay, wait, 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 one sec. 